What was it starting me with this time round? Barkler of Dadgen? That's not bad. Cloud doesn't do anything. Um. All the random skills that's giving me one of. I mean, the shield helps, I guess. I get fighting. Get shields, but I don't know if there's anything else for me to get right now. That's not a great start, but I do have the Buckler of Tension, which is helping me. Because often if you just want to do a jackal pack instantly, you can kind of struggle on. In fact, this Buckler of Tension is really good at this point in the game, I think. I don't know, why can't I get my humans... Pass lab properly. There's always either a run into problems around there. Um, oh well, I'll check out the faded all to see if that's any good. Ashen Zari, Sif Mother of a Human. I mean, Ashen Zari would be okay, but the run the gods wouldn't be so good. With all about spell casting. Did I get some spells? Static Discharge and Mercury Vapors. I don't think I'll worry about those. Not with like 12 inch, which is. Yeah, just not very good end. Uh, I'm trying to think of what god I go with. I'm not an archer or something, I'm just a melee character. Um, what's that god that's like really good? I mean, Okamara is one that I usually think of as really good. I didn't quite uh, pull through my other character, although I guess it, the other character got sent to the abyss. Um, I will get strength. Just like thinking if I wanted to pivot into anything else, because that was kind of the last chance I had to decide what attribute I was doing. Oh, I should, I should get myself a better weapon. This club's doing nothing. Uh, dagger, the short sword. I think a short sword does a little bit more than the club, so let's put that one on. Same damage, better accuracy, and better attack delay, I think. Hey, protection from cold. Alright, that's a decent rig. I mean, I don't think I'll need it for a little while though, until I start beating Ice Beast, but that's still something. I guess the Endoplasms can technically do cold. Alright, Acrobat's good. Boots are good. Uh, Wolfhound's good. Everything here is good so far. Oh, Natasha. I could try the paralysis, but it's only 30%. I'll give it a try. Oh, come on. I hate these 30% chances. At least I can stab her now that she's helpless. But I'm gonna have to fight her two more times. That's a mace. I don't know, a mace is not that great, but I could go with it. Uh, Thumb is... Oh, it's 1 up because minus 1.2 evasion. I put it on, but it's like basically the same as what I was wearing already. Do I want to convert? Hold on, how much does it do? Can't kill me in one go. I don't think I'll convert just yet. Also, I don't think this character would be tough enough to survive, like, the... Um, oh, that's not doing well. The challenges that would get sent by Bjorg anyway. So I reckon go with Bjorg would be a terrible idea. Hey, Natasha, uh... I guess that wasn't too bad this time around. What have we got? We got a little axe, a little hand axe. Still nothing too special in the way of weapons. I'll go check for weapons again, though. The spear, falchion, 
the few options. Trident? Trident could be alright. Uh... So Trident is 10 damage, 1.3 attack delay. Well, this thing is 5 damage, 1 attack delay. Yeah, I mean, definitely for now, this could be worth using. I'm just gonna have to uh, think about whether I trade the skill to use pole arms. I could. I could go pole arm and play aquatic character. Those are usually pretty good. There's more uh, pole arms here. I think they're two-handed. Uh, and Hepsi Aquatic is like really easy to abandon the old run as well. Like they don't get mad at you. They just, well, they kind of do, but they just sort of stop you gaining experience for a while. Um, which doesn't really matter on the old run, right? It's not like you're going to get enough to mana. Tasha again? That's no idea with the ebb. Oh, she got another ebb. Uh, I've got the escape hatch downwards. How much of the level for decent even explored? It's not much. It's us. Uh, I'm a human. I might take it because if I land somewhere on explore, they get the explore here at least. All right, we got a lot of ghosts in here. Dagger's ghostly, Springer, let's see. Though they're a Coglin hunter. Uh oh, what's happening? Not dropping a level. I'm actually. Oh, good. Yeah, it's fine. I'm, I'm actually quite low down, though, because I haven't. Have I finished the level above? I don't think so. Is that a magic region? Huh. Wasn't there a creature here? Where is it? Maybe not. Okay, hey, come on, give me Hepler Quata. There's a uh, backlip for what I need them later on, but there we go, that's Hepler Quata. I gotta go with Hep. Of course, I gotta get a bit of piety to get an answer, so I think I should be able to survive that long. Uh, there's lots of creatures. Are there still like gnolls on this level? I don't even know where they are. I guess they don't want to turn up on this. Oh! Plus seven fabric tried. They'll take that one. Uh, put it on. Can we try the paralysis? Let's check the charts. Nah, thirty three percent. I think I just stab. Ooh, I don't like this at all. I'll stab again. Oh no, thirty net points. Come on, thirty three percent is not. I tried curing, but I'm not sure it's going to help oh, a little bit. I want a 33% chance. Try a random scroll, but like it's probably just identify. It could be teleport. I'll try one of these. Teleport, good. I'll try the paralysis. Yeah, it failed. No surprises there. Oh, thank goodness. Um... That's, that's not what I meant to do. They're examine down that one. Got to move three. He's got to move two extra. Might be fine. All right. Hope they can just leave Prince Ribbon upstairs or something. Not to worry about fighting him because he absolutely slaughters me. Uh, also, I've probably got an identify here. I might just go read it. Oh, poison. Sure. Uh, what's that priest gets a view? I want to try and stab it. There we go. 
Oh, the Mace dead. I don't think I care about the War Axe of the Mace. This plus seven fabric trident should be doing a pretty good job. In fact, uh, this looks good enough. I should probably get some pull up skill. Uh, let me also go check. I put a little bit of fighting good. I do have that one set. I'd have to go out and explore party here, I think. So just got to explore a couple of levels. I should have an answer. So, oh, hey, Blockula. Uh, how's the paralysis? 50%? I'll give it a try. Come on, I've only got three charges left. Oh, come on. How did that all fail? I don't have a poison resist, do I? He has just killing him was the way to go, although he might reform me dead and he hastened up. But he should die when I actually kill him. He shouldn't be able to reform again because he has a cooldown on that one. Uh, oh, spells. Nothing too special. I'm going to evasion rig when I get that one. But I actually go put that on instead of the uh, co protection one. <laughs> That's actually kind of a handy door. I can just keep on bringing grinder with a pole arm range. There we go. Go rid of her. Hey, I've got an answer, so I've got, uh, yes. Which health do I have at this point? 25? That's not bad. Yeah, that kind of keeps me alive way better. I can hide behind them. I'll probably just, like, turn them into a knight or something. I quite like the knight. It's really good for hiding behind with a shield. So got oh blinking's great. Anything else is good. Emulation for later on. Oh, this is identified. I have got that identified. Maybe a vulnerability, maybe a teleport, maybe a poison. But I'll start with the blinking and identify. I might grab the other identify as well. And the emulation. And silence. The vulnerability. Oh, I can't quite afford it. Sure. <laughs> That's fine. I might just go identify some of my stuff. So I've got a hot DJ. Oh, heal is good. Haste is good. Just with Sean armor. I don't know if I got anything. Uh, I just want to enchant with my armor right now. I could check what armor I've got on. I could do like boots or something. Would be a terrible idea. What's this dude got? It's got something fancy. I want the roots. I was dead anyway, maybe? Huh. I was like, always ready to run away there if I needed to as well. But no, apparently my ancestors are just killing everyone. Uh, what is this manual? Ah, well, that's good. That's something I will end up using, so I'll pick that one up. Uh, do I want to get armor skill yet? I'll get the pole arms up to whatever I'm taking it to like 8 or something. And then I might actually get some armor because I got the manual and it's going to trade reasonably fast. Oh, Bottom Beetle. That's not great. Um, That's absolutely terrifying. What's a Bottom Beetle doing here? I can put a uh, poison? On it, I uh, enter the enter dead. No surprises. Um, I can hold it in the poison with some roots. Poison should kill it pretty quick. I don't know as much as I could do. Ha, there we go. 
Oh, that was terrifying. This is way too early for a bald beetle. Alright, next level down, I guess. Yeah, dodge level six. I mean, there was a... I know, like, a, a few versions back used to get the bald beetles that would spawn super early, and those were always terrifying. They got pushed a bit later on, but... Yeah, apparently they still sometimes appear way too early. Who's that ghost? God, Dagger's ghost, a Coglin hunter. Man, I must be leaving so many human, uh, wandering ghosts all throughout the dungeon. Probably not even, like, too bad at ghosts for other people to kill, because I don't think any of my characters so far have been super tough or anything. Oh, hey, Joseph. Uh, put some roots on him, but... I'm gonna kill my answers pretty soon. Sure, I mean, wasn't too bad, I suppose. Oh, oh yeah. Stag breaks the staircase. I've got a willpower on it, probably work. Well, these ghosts are locked in vaults now, yup. Yes, I'm not. I don't think I've killed too many people with my ghosts. <laughs> so I don't think my ghosts are too dangerous, thankfully. Uh, it's fine. I got my ancestor back. I, sh I should just back into this corridor and stop fighting, I think. Oh, I can't see my ghost living very long. No, my ancestors are being living very long. Get, get, I just get the skill till the value wears off. Yeah. I mean, it did something, I guess. Is that more health? Let's check. Hey, 35 health. That's, uh, yeah, it's kind of important to get health to keep him alive. It's also, the identity, I think, is the second or third pie there. I know you can get them an identity fairly early on. I don't remember exactly when. Ooh, is that just an ordinary spear? So they felt like a bit more than an ordinary spear, but I guess it was ordinary. Pika was freezing. That's fine. Um, I should run. And then my ancestor, when they come back again, I should start fighting again. <laughs> well, presuming over the corridor. There we go, that made that way easier than just trying to run up and fight things. Is this robe of willpower better than what I've got? Lose three? No, it's not really that protective. I would get, I've would. i got a willpower rig on as well, so unless I get a tangent rig or something, this probably doesn't make any sense to swap those round. Alright, next level. Uh, definitely bring these back to the staircase. I think my answers would like kill that dude all his own. It was getting pretty close to doing it. What was this? Oh, plus six spear? I got no, I got a plus seven trident of uh, stuff. God, how good a weapon it was. Oh, good. Now I can knight my ancestor. Let's go. All right. Uh, really a knight? Yes, it is so. I'm also going to rename them. I'm going to be so. Yes, I think. Do I do their identity? Uh, there we go. They have been knighted. I don't need a stuff of cold. Scale mail strength. What am I wearing? That could be better. So, AC's unchanged. Like, evasion increased by 0.3 and it gained some strength. Yeah, sure. That seems good to me. It looks fancy, too. Well, slightly more fancy than what I had on. Uh-oh, I have no poison resist. Right? I 
I do have a Berserk, though. I might use it. I think the um, Vampiric Draining will keep me going with the Berserk, hopefully. Because I don't really have an escape option there, so that was definitely the best thing I could do. All right, let's get the pull up to uh, 14 spend delay, is it, on this thing? Yeah, let's do that. Yes, yeah, so it's sort of like Hydra killing. Um, Polums are actually not terrible against Hydra's or Mabon. Ow, that's a lot of poison. Uh... Can I swap my answers? I can't swap my answers with anyone here. I wouldn't mind doing that. No, it's not working. Um, I mean, I can drink my other curing, but I'm still getting poisoned up. Do I have a... I do have a teleport. I might read it. Why does this guy poison me up again? What was down here? I might take another staircase. That looks kind of bad. What is that trident? It's not going to compare with mine, right? Heavy trident. Not really. Again, I'm going to get horribly poisoned up, but I can dump some roots on these guys, which kills them really quickly. Should probably dump some more roots out, actually, with how this is going. Alright, got conjugal lightning. No stuff I really need, though. Uh, I wasn't going to swap to the troll at the rob. I don't think it got oh, boots. Wait, hold up. I do want those boots. All right. One more armor class. 59 armor class is not bad. I think I've still got a little bit left on my manual. Oh, it's a main one again. He's got Venom, right? Can I buff my answers? Not really. Probably if my ancestor dies, which might not be too long. Take his weapon, but like, I, I kind of want to stick with pole arms because um, they're really good with my ancestors. My ancestors not healed, and that staircase case looks really bad. Uh, so I got plus two ring mail of positive energy or fire resist, but nothing else here. I need the cloak. Do I have one of those? Yeah, I do. Why are they picking up? It's all these random clubs and short swords and tridents and daggers, spears. What else is there? Ring mail, leather, boots. All right. I don't have a curare. Do I have that can work on this guy? I guess I could just stab it. I would love to fight a Curare, but I guess I don't have any poison resist, so fighting the poison guy myself could be a problem. Uh, ouch. I think I can kill this guy. There's a B after me though now, which is not great. I think I can make it back to the staircase. Excellent. And there's another one to go down over here. Uh... 
Uh, I can do the same one again, I think. Yeah, there we go. Bring the bees up one at a time. Do I have any curing left? I think I drank away curing, unfortunately. So, none left for me, but I kind of had to because I was getting absolutely massive with poison. So, I got Bombard, Hellfire Mortar, Barreling Boulder. I don't think those are the things I need. I'm not a Mountain Dwarf or something, so I can't cast them in armor. Oh, there are more books in here. These are self published books. But still, I don't think I really need those. Oh, so many dudes. Uh, wait, that's not. That's all right. Am I trying? There we go. Get the ancestor in the way so I can move back. That's what I was trying to do. There's a problem with that wyvern though, because it's fast to me. But I think if I go back to the staircase, it will just be me versus the wyvern. Uh, not needing a great sword. That shield's actually still decent, right? Because it's giving me armor class. Alright, let's go downstairs. There's a white? Where? There it is. Uh... I don't remember that my ancestors using like flail hasn't got attacked yet. So having it in the middle of those creatures is just a really bad thing. But at least one's an axe is kind of doing lots of damage, taking lots of damage, it's okay. Is there a uh, Josephina around here with all these whites? There's got to be right there she is. There's also a Curari dart for me here if I can survive. Fortunately, I think the ghostly fireball can hit me from here if she does it. And she did do it. Wait, what's up with her at the moment? She's all targeting my ally. I see. Uh, 40 is fine on the pull up, so let's go to 12 on the fire dig, and I probably go to 12 on the armor as well, which has got to get near the end of that manual. I can just close this door, right? I don't think an ice piece can open it. <laughs> Uh, my backup. <sighs> Whoops, that's fine. Just I was getting slowed for backing up there for a second by the oof tubers in front of me. Uh, oh, I do have flame. I've got a fed foliar summon hydra, not just bog summon forest. It's a decent summoning one. Because it gets you both the forest and the hydra. An unseen horror, it's an unseen horror. It's kind of funny. With the simulacrum, and you can see them. Actually, can this character see invisible anyway? They can. I guess for me, it would be more of a seed horror anyway, whether it was a simulacrum or not. Alright, do I go down? I'll have to go down one more level here. Can I do anything with my ancestors yet? I can transfer them, which is quite good for repositioning sometimes. I 
And the Yanks really don't stand the chance when I've got the way for this fabric drink. Oh, I didn't get that much health back. The cycle's like 50 something damage on them. They're rock. They roll max damage on it. I know it's a, it's a terrifying amount of damage at least. Did I get a Kirari? I did. It always makes those ogres so much uh, better, but I've only got one left and I've got to use it for both ogres and. and what else do I Kirari? Bold Beetles. I don't know, I feel like there's something else that I often Kirari. There's not too many things in the lag because so many things are poison resist. Oh, Sharks, I think, or something I can get with the Kirari. Anyway, let's do the scrolls here we got. Oh, Brian weapon? Don't need it yet. If I get a demon trident, I guess I need it, but the demon trident is said to be the uh, quite rare, I think. I did go with like Okumaru either, so I won't get gifted one. But I haven't regretted having quite at all there. They've been quite helpful with the answers that they give me. The chance forty percent. Oh, I don't like that. I've got another one. Um, and Harold. I gave Harold the shark. That was fast and I retreat. Uh, I don't know what Harold does. Three back to Calvin Ball, but I get petrified. Yeah, I think Harold lost strike me, thankfully. Gotta have Nets. He always does. Wait, he's only got one this time around? Oh, well, I guess it's only one more net for me. It's, uh, it's kind of a good thing when he doesn't have lots of nets. But it also means you get less when you kill him, right? <laughs> Alright, what do I want? Um, The arm is still going. Oh, I might just... Yeah, it's, it's, surely it won't go much longer. I'll just bring it up a little bit. As I was just get a little bit of invocation. I'll check that I've got mid delay. I think I do. Good. You can always get more fighting. That was always useful. Oh, and I can get a little bit more shields, actually. Prepare for fighting, like, a kite shield or something. Although, I could uh, get rid of a little bit more of the attack penalty on the buckler. Although, I don't know. I feel like shield skill is not very good at getting rid of a buckler's attack penalty. There we go. Uh -huh. Let's do the armor. Actually, let's stop the armor. His shield's up to eight. Oh, dodging not good. I could get a little bit of dodging. You know, let's get like five dodging, see if it makes much difference. I am wearing medium armor, so yeah, a little bit of dodging is not a bad idea. Oh, seven healing potions. At least this character's got healing potions. What else have I got? I got blinking three of those. I got telepods. Oh, and I got a hydra. Why just climb back up? How buff the answers you get. How about some roots of the Hydra? I won't give it extra heads. This is probably still the right weapon to use. At least it's only a small Hydra. That does make a difference how big the Hydras are. I'd probably struggle with an eight-headed Hydra, but a four-headed Hydra is just fine.
Is there a really unique or any unique to specifically have pull-ups? I guess it's Jeremiah, but this one's not usually that special. Because I know there's like a maven with a demon whip. Like, what's a demon whip? Uh, how many heads? Five. Probably fine. There are these other guys coming along as well. I know, fire just, I'd love to emulate these guys. You know what, I'm gonna do it anyway, because my answer is up the front. Yep, there we go. That's another Hydra fight better. I'll get my answers back before I find that one. That's not the best time for it to come along. I might just bring it back to the staircase. All right, there we go. Five minute Hydra's dead. Let's go down again. No, I think this weapon's doing a lot of work for me. The whole fact was like plus seven and it's got Vampiric Draining. Vampiric Draining is like an excellent brand. So yeah, that's really helping. Ooh. Try move back and construct it though, so it makes it quite a bit harder. How many heads six headed? They're progressively getting larger, so uh not perfect. I'll try roots it up. This one's gonna be seven headed, right? If it continues the theme, anyway. Uh, I've actually got a lot of more lower levels. That was only the second level, so I could have way more hydras. And land over, okay, fine. I just know uh, it's not an extra tree, so yeah, it should be fine. How much difference does that invasion make? I'm really not sure. Uh, it just get some mod dodging. Might give it a try, see how much of a difference it makes. I'll also get the armor class. Oh, well, I'll just go to 14. Fighting to 14. And then probably the invocations is the next thing to get after that to make my... um I Oh, wait. Oh, Idealize is unlocked already? Hold up. Let me, let me go get that. I oh, come on. Let's go get that idealized going right now. Um, so eight is probably enough, and then I'll go back to training the other skills. I wonder what that scale bell willpower would be worthwhile. Let me go check it. Plus one. I've currently got strength armor on, so it's helping out my damage. Um, let's go check this though. One armor class minus 0.3 evasion, so it's a little bit more protective. How much damage do I lose? I'm doing uh, 26 damage, 24 damage. Could put on like a competition ring instead of the willpower, but I might actually just leave that on with the willpower. That way, I can't be petrified or anything, which is great. Uh... Yeah, it certainly does free up that ring for later on. Ooh, that's not quite right. Let's go here. That's a better spot. How much do I need positive energy? I've already killed, like, uh, Josephine. She's, like, the main one that actually requires that. Okay, what, is, what can I drop? Oh, I probably don't need the flame. I'm killing the Hydra a different thing. I don't need the magic regen. Why do I see invisible is the question. Do I, oh, it's my trident. So I currently don't need the ring, but when I swap my trident, which will probably be quite a lot later on, I will need it. Is there any revelations to get to that? No, I can't revelations, but there is a minotaur. On this level.
It's not telling me how far away it is. Oh, that's terrifying. Because this guy's going to be slowed down. And then it's death, Yags. I might just teleport. Ooh, drums nearby, okay. Uh really a mark. Probably gonna pull on like that top sound stuff again, but I'll hide around here. I'll probably have to teleport. Wow, that's a lot of poison. I'll kill some of it up, but. No way my ancestor survives here. Good. The mic's gone, so if I need to teleport, I can. I think if I just. Well, like, parallels probably doesn't work. I think if I just roots this guy up, he should be able to kill it, but it's about to go berserk. Drums distant, okay, so it's not this way. Uh, it's got to be down and to the left, I think is where it is. No, oh, or just down. Uh, I do a potion attraction. Got to free up some inventory before I go in here, though. I might, I might drop the demon the whip. I'll drop the rope because my whip is doing really well right now. So I'll drop the old armor. Grab if it gets the outside for because it's gonna be ages before I find something to brand. Yeah, it's probably fine. Four inventory slots. I right, got plus one boots. There's more boots in there if you fall a bunch of berserk wolves. These guys, I think, are quite tough, right? The Red Devils? You can never really remember like this early on how tough one is, but I think they're decently tough. Oh, that Reef is definitely too tough for me. Yeah, that's uh, plus two sides of protection. No, I wouldn't be able to fight that. I wouldn't be able to fight this Fire Crab either, unless I can get Fire Resist, in which case it probably wouldn't be too bad. But I can't get Fire Resist. Uh, that helmet looks fancy. Ah, no simulacrums. They can get cold resist though. So what have you got? Harpy, Sentinel Warrior, Sentinel Warrior, Sentinel Warrior. Um, guarding an artifact ring. Oh, the Hydra as well. Do you think this side is the way to go? Good though, it's the whole stealing the houses keep me going. Boost the rampage, yeah, that's not bad. They can sometimes be a little awkward with staircases, but they're usually pretty good. Uh, don't have an acid resist, do I? Oh well. Doesn't look like I'm gonna need it though. As a helmet of willpower. Sure. I don't think I've got a helmet on, so I'll take some willpower. Um, <laughs> two decks is also fine. I probably, I probably just put on the cold resist instead of willpower. The willpower is doing pretty good right now. Uh, I guess that brings it down to two. I could theoretically go over the third one. Anyway, I need cold resist in here. What's the best place to open this up? Oh, of course, there's another door. Uh... This is alright. That cold resist was definitely necessary though. Alright, what do I want? Um, how's that dodging? Oh, I didn't trade the dodging yet, so it's gonna get dodging, fighting, and AC, I think. The ring is... Oh, poison resist, good. Resist negative magic poison. Okay, I'll uh, take out the cold resist. I'll put on the poison resist, I think. 
I don't know what the Minotaur is going to have, so I don't know which one's best against him right now, but this was more of this, so better chance of working, I guess. What do I have? I got a Curari, right? Got some Nads. Because also these Minotaurs can be quite tough. Actually, I should check what resist it has. There's Silver Javelin's plate armor, so it doesn't have poison resist. Excellent, absolutely trivial. <laughs> Once it gets QR read up. Uh, oh, Regen Fire Resist Ambulance. That sounds good. Body Shop Protection. I'm not really thinking of going two handed, but like I can. Ah, uh, I can drop those old boots. So much unidentified stuff here. It makes it hard to see. Anyway, what was my amulet? It was Acrobat, which is decent, but I might put on the fire as just um, regen one. I think I need the poison dust. I, I lost my cure by the looks of things, which is a bit of a shame. Anyway, I'll pick up the Bardiche in case I want to go two-handed. Um, They need a lot of skills, so I don't have the skill for it just yet. And I, I didn't really want to go two-handed. Uh, there's like a choke point there, but I might just run back until I get an ancestor, I think. No, I'll hide this choke point. I think it'll be fine. Uh, I'll leave the positive energy. I've got like the poison resist one also has positive energy on it, so not exactly gonna need any more positive energy. Oh, more stuff! I wish I had lots of my uh, lots of my identifiers or something. I might drop the acrobat. I think I'm good with willpower now. Yeah, three willpowers, plenty. Uh... Right, one more level to let to go by the looks of things. Oh, what? Why did I go to level 1? I must have misclicked or something. I thought I was ready to like, go to level 5 there. I probably just didn't press the 5 to... Oh, Alright, so I would have just defaulted to level 1. How many heads? 6 headed. And these little uh, dudes aren't doing a lot to me. I'm keeping my health up anyway, so... It's weird how those ones are either like really, really tough or really weak depending on character. And this character is definitely the one that makes them really weak. It mainly seems to be based on like your physical protect uh protections. Oh. All three seconds. So yeah, I might just go to this one. Wait out the mic. And go down. I don't know. It doesn't really matter moving that much. Yeah, it's basically the same spot. Um All right, where's uh? Ah, not that one. That'll do. I've got a fire in the snow. I might emulate these dudes. I don't want too many to get next to me though. Uh. I transferred my ancestor to here. Good. Huh. Fine. I think this is so fine. I don't need to uh, any sort of transference or thing. Seven headers. It's gonna kill my insist in no time.
All right, looks like I managed to clear my staircases back again. Now, getting back to those staircases when all three staircases are in the same spot is never the best thing in the world, but it looks like I dealt with it just fine. I don't need poison resist ring, thankfully, because I got a better one. No, I like how, uh, like, obvious this um cult swing does is now you can really stand out because i know before sometimes you get caught out end up uh, i mean it's still you can still um spend too many turns just like hitting tab or something and end up with the cult swing does but at least now you're gonna like see it if you're paying attention uh... i might take this guy all the way back to the staircase It's funny how this, like, corner is too steep that the creatures often can't get around it. Um, no, it does fairly consistently happen that they fail to get around. Oh, this is gonna die again. A spring. There we go, death yank upstairs. Uh, there's going to be more of the uh, kind of believers guys in here to try and petrify me, but there's always a corridor a bit further on that has one. Kind of hiding in the corridor, ready to petrify you. Which is not this one, this is just an extra bonus one. Uh, I've got a manual of axes, that doesn't help me that much. I get some evocation, I get like five of that, because I got some wand of roots. Acid as well, actually, which is decent. Yeah, this is the corridor. There should be a catablepus. I don't even want to use this fire breath, but that can be kind of bad if it gets you in, like, stuck in the corridor, if something comes up behind you, or anything like that. We've got, oh, we've got lots of potions, but they're not stacked. Oh, lignification, sure. Um... I should run up to those guys, that would be a bad idea. Well, wrong way. Now, they hide the choke point. I do have that dingy if I need to get back to the staircase, but no, I'm, I'm fine in the choke point. Uh, it's just another potion I think it's gonna do. There we go, some ambrosia. Alright, well, uh, dungeon time, I guess. I think I finished dungeon level 11 to dungeon level 12. What? Where am I going? Dungeon level 7, apparently. That's not right. Uh... And it'll be the orcish mines after this, I guess. Whoa. I presume we'll get a nice entrance, because sometimes the entrance to Yorkish Mines is kind of a real mess. I'm hoping it's not this time around. Oh, three identified? Good. So we've got uh, Potion of Enlightenment, which I do pretty well. Willpower is still not bad. We've got some Invincibility. A scroll Noise. I can probably drop the Scroll Noise. <laughs> um... Oh, Revelations? Okay. <sighs> buff the Ancestor, I think. I might buff them again. Okay, most of these guys can't shoot me. This isn't too bad. I mean, it kind of looks bad. Hey, my Ancestor's got an axe. Excellent. That's going to help when I get into the Orcish Mines. Um, I could go two handed. It's actually possible. I might get more fighting. 
And then I'll think about going two-handed, because I do have the uh, Bardis, which is not a bad weapon. And I could brand it up with whatever of those potential right now, which is, uh, fine. I can't do it. I, just, uh, I don't know. No, I should probably just go to the Orcish Mines. That Edelin's pretty scary. Why not buff the Ancestor? Right. Um. I actually just. Dig. Wait, did I not have digging? So I really thought I had digging, but I guess not. Um, and I'll emulate these guys. What did I do against this one? So I got, I got paralysis, I got acid, I got roots. I've actually got a reasonable amount of my life left still. Um, <laughs> Mine was a lot, but I wish I had some roots. Ah, uh, dig it, I mean. I don't know what the right thing to do. I might have zapped with some more acid. Unfortunately, he doesn't have rage to get too many of these guys. Uh... Alright, the Altra C should take the rest out. No problems. Well, maybe a few problems. Uh, this was still mine. I should go. Oh, no, it's no longer mine. Yeah, excellent. Because I know those guys can do like, I don't know, 40 or 50 damage or something while mine is. How's the chainmail compared with whatever I'm wearing? It's almost three more armor class effectively. Uh, but I lose willpower. Oh, I think it's worth it. We'll leave me a little bit short of the willpower, but not like super short of the willpower or anything. I know there's like the orc uh, sorcerer and stuff that can paralyze and heal. Well, that's quite a lot of guys. And they all bite it up all of a sudden. Uh, oh, I can't split these. So that's probably fine. Yeah, I don't think I'm even going to need to use any mods or anything. All right. Uh, Rampage is great when you're fighting archers. You can just kind of kind of run up to them. Yeah, about the ring mail fires this much. Well, good chat arm is good. It's my boss if I wanted to get that identified, but I won't worry about it too much right now. I'll see what other thing is the uh, dodge well the we could buy this offer at shops first. I like that sun demon. I got lots of fire dust. Uh I just go in front of my ancestor for a little while. Because the ancestors would die to the sun demon way too quick. Actually, do they have fire dust? They do, but they still would have died to it way too quick. Buff the ancestor, I think. Try to keep them alive against the Adam, because I know the Adam's head for huge damage. Forty percent of paralysis. I might swap that with a little bit of um, enlightenment, wherever that is. I know I had some. Here it is. Chogaran. 
Would be bad as bad if they weren't uh, quite as many things around them. <laughs> Might uh, gonna hope that some of the other up staircases lead next to them and onto six school. This one for now. It's not a great chance that they all meet up. Ooh, that's a lot of stuff. But I gotta. I do have a jerk point here, but there's also this dude. Um, I think I still stay here. Or for devastation. No, those little range things. I'll probably get turned to melee and make it walk up to me. Uh, I think acid's got range. Really? I teleport out. It's got like a toxic and stuff. Oh, vulnerable to cold. That's sad. Can I uh, mutate myself? No, I can't because I don't know about that one. Oh, I'm just going to try one of these potions, but it's unlikely to work. Magically purged doesn't help. Um, oh, what have I got left? Let me go check. I don't want to waste too much stuff. Magic's fine. I don't want to waste the resistance. Experience is fine. Brilliance is fine. Oh, I just drink something. How's brilliance? Which is fine. Magic's fine. Oh, experience. Okay. Uh, might as well get the fighting. Um, uh, what else have we got? One of these. No, I gave myself a bad temper. Oh, I hate that mutation. I've shot fingernails and mine two strands. Well, I know about the mutation potions, I just don't have any of them left. So I gotta open one of these shop sells one, because I'm gonna keep on losing my temper. What is that axe? Heavy. Raw axe. It's not a bad axe. Um, I've kind of gone heavily into pull ups already. Ooh, I might actually teleport out of this. Because I'm still bobbed up, which is really bad. I don't think I have an answer. So no, I don't. Uh, what can I do? I'll just let these get a little bit closer and then find them. <sighs> I'm reading another teleport. Hey, I'm no longer bobbed. Uh, how much that helps? Hey, I got an answer to the back. There's another one of these tough ones. I really need a digging. That would be super nice right now. I don't need to I might do another teleport, but it's taking so many of my teleports. Come on, really? I do like the answers, and I think I just killed the guy that's bringing out the Quoxic. Ow. 50 something damage? How do I get this guy to chill off? Um, I don't really have anyone to run, do I? I know that it leads back to more guys. Like, get it away from me with a um, Sock Man Ancestor, but then what? I think I polymorph it into. Sea Snake Caterpillar for Minotaur. Oh, I see. Anyway. I'll start by swapping plays with my answers, I guess. They're pretty well. I think I can just emulate. Because I put like clouds of fire and stuff on them, which is great. Uh... Alright, let's check out the weapon shop we got here. Iridescent hat axe. Oh, uh, I might have to go with those two handed bandages at some stage. I, I don't know. The other thing is, uh, it's like me, it's a good axes, but I don't know if there's anything else in weapons. I don't really want to look through the whole list. I wish it was like where to just look at the high tier ones or something. Uh, I just look at pole arms. 
might be more useful. He was like tridents in here, demon webs. Jungle's like a wasn't there a really good broad eggs as well, but I can't see that on this list. Am I just missing it? I don't know. Oh, there's a granite talisman of cold resist. I can't afford it. Um, I don't think I'd go with a granite talisman. I got into armor on this character. I think I'm doing pretty well with the armor. Uh, oh, this is the with the axe, with the heavy broad axe. That's where it is. <laughs> Like, tempting, but uh, I don't know. Oh, the robe of the vines. It's probably not that protective. So let's take a look at it. I lose 10 armor class. I can't really lose 10 armor class. That's an excellent robe if you're like a genie or something, because then you get a ton of health regen. You get to spam your spells. Not another Nick Quark Zeke. I don't think that one got me, thankfully, but my mutations are looking a little brutal after doing this place. Yorkish Mines is not usually known for its mutations, but. It was like Geogran or something? Yeah. Uh, I do have a silence, don't I? I do, excellent. That'll make him kind of weak. Especially when I'm berserking up. Alright, uh, that's, that's the entirety of the Orcish Mines, I think. So I've got a more chant on if I want it. Can't shout my helmet. I can't shout my boots. I guess I could do my cloak. <laughs> I'll just, uh, I think I might wait till I get some better armor. That's not really got a lot of stuff to enchant all there. Alright, what have we got? What am I looking for? I can't even remember. And apart from like potions and mutations, I'm not actually sure there is a particular thing I'm looking for. I'll say top of those teleports at some stage. I've got a bit, uh, bit done in by my trip to Yorkish Mines. Stoshing again. So I took out my last character with some distortion on Sonya. Ah, no. My. Oh, wait, this is fine. A little bit of transference. Um. Trying to get over the point morph, but, like, it's hard to line it up. Human, Kali, Kavora, Sandal, that's fine. Oh, because the Sandal can still use the uh, Stosh Dagger. Of course it can. And the Human would have been able to as well, I think, unfortunately. Uh, plus the Archite Shield, that's alright, but the Orange Brain is going to get something, so I got to... Let's just fight this guy, maybe. Alright. So if I look at this, I gain uh, 4.5 shield value, which is the good part, but I lose 3 armor class and 0. 0.8 evasion. Ooh. And I also lose like 0. Uh, 0.08 uh, attack delay or something. Oh, ponderous armor? So if I put on this armor, I gain 6 armor class and lose a fire resist, although that's not too bad losing a fire resist. And also I start moving slow. Ah. Uh, no, I don't think so. Alright, got torment. Oh, an acquirement. I got... Uh, yeah, I gotta try that acquirement, see what it gives me. So it's offering a ring of willpower, plus two. Strength plus four, but it's also fire, which is not great. Or money, or manual range weapons. That was ice or something, I might be able to use it, but not fire. Is that a flaming axe? Yeah, good. <laughs> Shake all the hydrants around, but I'm pretty sure the ancestor is pretty good against that sort of thing. Stortion. 
Also, George, I might drink the mutation. Hope for the best with getting rid of that. Um, there we go. Tidy those up a little bit. I wasn't actually the berserk wasn't coming out too much, so it didn't come up at a bad time, thankfully, but that's always a terrifying mutation to have. Like usually it's a uh, it's good, but then sometimes it'll just get you killed, so can't really go with it. Oh, well, that's a good archer. Uh, I gotta run up to these dudes, don't I? I was all gonna merge. I'll move here, it's making it harder for them to merge. You never want those ones uh, line leading to you because then they will all merge, I think. What have we got here? Fear. Actually, no, I think they will move around if they can. Oh, nothing unidentified. I guess I did, like, uh, co-op IDs on my potions, but still. Got a the whole influx of the identify scrolls. Already scouts. Am I like resistant to negative? I am. I'm not even sure. I think that's on one of my rings. But it, it does the trick. Ah, fire is the one I've got. It's the cold resist I think I'm missing. Amber is a slight trick, but that's not quite as important at this point of the game, specific, especially. Uh. Alright, I've got one more level to dodge, and then I've got another side, like, on a branch to go to. I am not sure what branches do I have, even. I've got the swamp and the snake pits. Poison fire resist. I could go to either with those. It's really a question of which one I think will be easier. Um, I always have to try the swamp, although I don't have a lot of health. That's kind of why I'm questioning if that makes any sense or not. All right. Because you can get like bited bunny ups and stuff, and they can hit for absolutely massive damage in a single turn, but they don't usually get bited. Oh, this guy got trying to freezing. All right. Ah, oh, 90% on Agony. No. Oh. I don't know if it could use it through my dude. Probably not. Alright, what's it on the case? <laughs> okay, I'll bring one of these ugly things up. Unfortunately, cold. Um, I think I can change the colors. I think I've still got a couple of polymorphs. Yeah, two polymorphs. Uh -huh. Am I gonna need to run or... <laughs> Oh, there's a Malia. I think I probably should get back to the staircase and bring it upstairs. What I'm missing it's gloves. I'll so just make sure there aren't some of those around. Nope, doesn't look like it. Also, I should back up here, I think. Just a lot of these ugly things. And if I move forwards, I would definitely get myself surrounded by them. Oh, I moved there. That was maybe not the most sensible spot in the world.
What's up with this guy? He's got something on it. It's got a wand of paralysis. I mean, my willpower is decent. I'll be behind my own dude. Um, I can see invisible, right? So can my guy. What else could I do? I mean, I can also splash him with acid. I guess my guy having an axe is more likely to end up hitting the right one as well. So I gotta do something with this uh, requirement. I don't really need that rig. You don't really need the range manual. I might just take the money on it. Uh, let's try to check out the other one. See if that one's better. Fire resist ring with three decks. Or a glaive of pain with fire resist. Or more. Why is it giving me range manuals? I don't even have range skill, do I? I don't know. It's giving me them to me anyway. We got a uh, Tuck Luo's Ghost Deep Elf. I want to play a Deep Elf at some stage. Deep Elf is Sith Mana because apparently they're like magic read gen or something. I've got like a, I've got like an Alchemist left. I think I don't have many. All right, it's time for the swamp, I think. Uh, let's get the pole arms to a bit. 24? Wow. Ow. Not gonna be enough. That was a little, that was a very long trip. Okay, let's go find some snakes. I have fear. I, I've only got one fear. Because they also like teleport stuff around you. Um. Ow. Ow. Uh, I'm not sure this is any better, honestly. Do have the right resist, but... I don't know, maybe it's better. Hey, I can identify whatever this is, because I can identify lying around. It's amnesia. I can probably drop the amnesia. Uh... I move up here, that's not a bad spot. Although I guess I can get two dudes put behind me there. Good thing about uh, uh being able to try like, transfer into my ancestors, though that can sometimes get you out of uh situations where you're surrounded. Sometimes, depending where your ancestor is and whether they're alive or not. Wait for frost. Uh I could call resist ring. All right, let's magic map to get to that one, I think. Right down? Yeah. It's a lot of worries, don't they mine each other? There they go. Yeah, they do mine each other. And it makes them considerably tougher. Uh, I'll the shield before I go on. What am I wearing? Chainmail fire resist. Sure. I don't need to see invisible right now either. Probably lose the acquirement outside, but I gotta pick that up at some stage. All right, let's put on the cold resist, obviously, before I go on. Uh, poison resist doesn't seem that important. Let's go on. Now there's gonna be any snakes or anything in here. They're so mainly just uh, beasts. Ugly things. Maybe some simulacrums, we'll see. Maybe not for this one. Some of them don't seem to have simulacrums. They have other cold themed creatures. All right, hey, scarf resistance. I can get a, nah, yeah, my clothes nothing really. So it looks like an armor class, but I got the uh, taking cold resist now. Uh, that will be a cover this, but I've got my rig swapped around as well, which is nice. Sometimes these places also have shields and cover this, but I'm not sure I really need a shield because I haven't found a one handed weapon yet. I'll probably eventually get onto one handed weapons, but I don't know. I might use that two handed glaive for a while. We'll see. I don't like how far away that statue is. 
Uh, can I first turn it? <laughs> okay. <laughs> sure, I can't transfer it. <sighs> really, they can't be everywhere. Oh, this water area. That's like awkwardly far away. I try fog, but I'm not convinced. That wasn't terrible. Because they summon so many shadow creatures that they could be kind of bad. But hey, the fog actually does the trick this time around, which is great because you can't always rely on the fog. Uh, stab with the guy that's freezing the walls. I won't be able to hit it with most of my attacks, but. Hey, it's worth a try. It's probably more of those dudes that freeze walls. Oh, yeah, there's one in here. I like getting my answers of life sometimes in those situations. It's called rope resistance. Any crystal plate armor of gold resist? Whoa, okay, that's fine. Let's see what else comes along with Frost Giant. Sure. Oof. Hard to keep my answers alive there. I was like uh, buffing it up, but it was almost dead. I should probably get more invocations or something if I want that to work a little bit better, but uh, that's fine. All right, boots are flying. Mine are like rampaging. Uh, plate armor colors. Let's go take a look at that. So I put it on, I gain. Oh, I actually gain a little bit of defense. I swap around some resist, which is whatever. Sure, let's do it. Uh. Broad axes. I keep fighting with broad axes, but I haven't decided to go with broad axes. Ooh, grab a tambourine. Those are nice. I can drop. I have bottle running to cover this. Uh... I do have stuff to drop. I might actually drop that axe. Grab the tambourine. Tambourine to get out of here. Oh, whoops. The rope resistance. I don't think there's anything I need here. Morning star of cold damage. No, nah, everything in there is pretty useless. Gets to get out. I want to swap back to my poison resist, of course, because they're going to fight snakes. Let's look at my resist. Too fire, too cold. No resist electric, but apart from that, they're looking pretty good. Oh, I haven't got throwing yet, have I? That doesn't be too much of a problem because I got rampaging. Uh, something to think about, though. Oh, was my polyps already 16? Huh. Oh, 14, I think, was the mid delay on this thing. Yes, I didn't go that high. <laughs> but now I'm going to go, like, 24 or something ridiculous. All oh, these electric snakes, shock serpents. Did it die? I thought it just backed up, but I can't see it anymore. Oh, it did just back up. I don't know why it just backed up, because it didn't really get itself into a better spot, because it, it could, like, get back up. If it could back up and zap me, then obviously that would be a very sensible thing for it to do, but it didn't seem to have a spot to zap me from. Did I have a helmet? I did, right? Yeah, you got the willpower one. It's gloves that I need. Uh, oh, my ancestor. So, Kia Hiss remembers more of her skill. She does the 60 hit points now, which is what? Uh, just over half of mine? That's just what my ancestor often has with like, a lot of characters. I mean, some of the healthier things like trolls, I think. It's not quite like that. Oh, it's a big tower shield protection. That's a, that's a wonderful shield. Um... If I stick one-handed, that's the shield to go with. To 
kind of make it worse thinking one hand. I need to find like a, I don't know, trident, demon trident, any kind really would do. I think I could grind off or whatever. All right, let's go down again. This does seem to be the right spot to be doing. It seems to be going down to my little trip into the swamp was going. He, uh, Robo's resistance, right? Now those are gloves, so I don't need to care about that magic thing. Oh, gloves. Magic gloves. Let's see what else there is here. Captain's Colors is like a rapier that sort of speed. It's pretty good if you're into short blades. In fact, it's actually excellent if you're into short blades. There's Triple Sword. I don't want Triple Sword character. I got 40 decks, but I barely got any decks. Let's get the gloves. The gloves are definitely useful. Plus one. Oh, yeah. I don't really care about the bookshop. My manual, manual, uh, it's book of the warp. I mean, eventually I might get a book of the warp, but it's not, not a hurry with that one. If, uh, manifold would all be great with the Badish, but just so hard to get going. I don't think it's going to happen. Uh, I'll the magic on the floor. Um, I play quite, I think, use a little bit, but it's not really needed. Yeah, back for it at some stage. If I, um, cloud some more inventory room or something, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why I come back for it. Oh, Death Talisman. Um, I'll leave it on the floor for now, but, like, if I wanted to go extended, a Death Talisman's ideal for that. Heavenly Aquan is not the ideal god for going extended, though, so, uh, I'd probably just go, like, Shining One or something. I don't think this character plans on going extended, but you never know. I might, uh, find a particularly excellent weapon or something and decide I want to keep on playing the character for longer. This is... Oh, I should prop my ancestor. I reckon I wouldn't do much better than my ancestor if I got some rounds, I'd start dying as well. How many of these enchant weapons have I got? I've got... Oh, none. The scale mill. Oh. Huh. A lot of guys that can teleport stuff around me. That is absolutely not where I want to be. I might still teleport. Um, got to teleport trap. Okay. Sure. Well. Oh, really? I read another scroll. That's that's probably where I can get zapped. I have to read the fear, unfortunately. Uh. Yeah, that was kind of bad. Like, uh. I could have read, like, a teleport to cancel the teleport, but I didn't know it was going to put me in a bad spot. I probably should have known, because there wasn't too much of this level explored currently. I was going to the weirdest timing, though, on teleports. You just got a teleport trap on the turn that I read a teleport scroll. Uh, what's up with the... This dude. Wanted flame, that's fine. So any of those, I mean, I guess some of those make sense for those water flame ones to be mind dangerous, but it's just kind of funny. Or, well, it's technically might, um, having an unusual item rather than dangerous, but... I leave that there until last because that's almost certainly the rune chamber on there. I mean, I've killed some of the guys from it, but I want to want to explore the rest of the level so that the guys don't come up behind me while I try to fight my way through the rune chamber. Uh... Oh, 
Alps and minus five and resist. I don't have butterflies, but I think I do a fear. And the curing. Nah, so much poison. I don't like this minus poison for this. Yeah, the minus poison for this. God, how much damage does this guy do though? I might need a healing potion. It does spit poison? Okay. Virulence? I think this is fine. Oh. Ah. I might grab a tambourine these days. Hmm. Yeah, it's working. This is a couple of those guys. It's quite tough when they mine it up. Uh. How's that polearm skill doing? 18. Let's go take a look at these weapons. So this one here does 46 damage, 0.9 attack delay. Right. I mean, it's a lot more damage, but it's 0.9 attack delay. And I think... Yeah, it's like one and a half times attack delay, and this one's almost 30 damage. It's not... It doesn't quite work. Because I had to lose, like, uh, 6 shield value, 3 armor class. I don't know. What else do I have to lose to put it on? 4 strength. And also, I think the Vampiric brand is better than the, um, Tension one <laughs> for this character. Oh, she had a cold resist. I don't really need that one. I mean, I could, uh, I could go put it on. I'm trading a lot of shield value. It doesn't make sense if I'm going to go two-handed. All right, well, let's unexcluded the uh, final Eric here. I don't know how many of these guys are actually left in here. Presumably quite a lot. And I reckon it's... Oh, I recognize this layout. There's going to be more of the guys that shift guys around you on the other side of here. Like, there's going to be nothing and then suddenly a whole bunch of creatures. Um, That's what it usually is like anyway. They're going to pick off the smaller groups they can. But eventually there's going to be a shifter to shift stuff around me. That's a kite shield protection? Maybe put that one on. Slow down my attack a bit, but... Plus two. Bigger shield. Yeah, I think it's worthwhile. Getting so many protection shields this time around. It's a shame I'm <laughs> going two-handed, but... Oh, well. Maybe the game will deliver me a demon trine. <laughs> I'll be able to change my mind on that. Who knows? Alright. I just up. Uh, I don't think that's too bad though. There's only two of those guys. I haven't seen so many of the guardian servants. I saw some earlier. Now there's one. Kind of not really like the right spot to do anything, thankfully though. Alright, my answer got the tower shield going, which is nice. 
Yeah, I think I might have been super lucky with the sounding that the uh, guy in up was just ended up in like really bad areas for actually doing anything. Right, there we go. First rune of this character. Probably time for the swamp. Yeah, let's do it. Whoa, that do it again. I definitely got to bring this dude up so that the trees aren't hitting me. Uh. Oh, it's the place that drags you around. Also, my better. Uh... I've got like the boots of flight. I lose two armor class and I lose a rampage. I think it's probably still worth it to have it in here, but it's a bit more questionable. It means I can stand above the water and attack normally, which is nice. Um, yeah, no, it's probably worthwhile. I got endless cover I don't even need that because I've got like, uh, what, two cover resists already. So putting on two rings of cover resists would be a bit overkill, I think. I have an acid resist, I think. I think that's one of the ones I'm missing. It's probably not too bad with bullfrogs. But if there were too many bullfrogs, it'd be a problem because they do corrode up eventually. And they can do decent damage, but I think they're not the most scary creature in here. Alright, level one of the swamp was not too bad. Let's go down. Oh, those the fire dudes. That's fine. Pretty sure my fire is still sitting on two, so. Gotta kill the Hydra. I want one of my answers to kill that guy, otherwise the Hydra gets mited. <laughs> yeah, that's probably fine with that guy getting mited, but... Uh, yeah, Hydras have a lot of heads. If they get mited, it's a lot of damage. I don't need the other cover resist ring. I'm never gonna wear it. Oh, what's happening? Or getting shafted. Uh, do I have a revelation? I've got one. I could use that to go upstairs, although I just saw the upstairs case, so I guess there's no need. I can just do that. And I think go oh, plus 10 plate armor. Uh, mount what? Core resist, okay. I'd be left with one core resist, but like, that's fine. It's plus 10. Let's just take it. It's, uh, yeah, a lot better. There we go, 35 armor class. Can't complain about this armor. This might even be my endgame armor if I want it to be. Um. Yeah, I mean, it's not golden dragon armor, but like, my resist, I'll probably fine with this one on. Uh. It's already pre-enchanted. But what it might make sense to do, if I can get a demon tribe, which hopefully I can at some stage, it might make sense to just to enchant my shield or something and just um, not worry too much about the armor. I know that makes sense to here. I might draw the polymorph. The flame can make steam, which can be useful, but... Uh... I'll still get the column skill. It just seems a little excessive.
I don't know why I carried around the trident. I don't know, it doesn't seem the, the most useful thing for me to be carrying around. I mean, sometimes I, I haven't given you a cell trident before. That's the reason I carried around. It's like, once or twice, well, outside of Tomb, Tomb I use it quite a bit. Outside of Tomb, I've like used it once or twice. So I just end up carrying it around. I don't like these trees. How do I get answers to get the ability to speed up? That's kind of nice. That must be a pretty recent thing. I don't think I've seen them do that before. How am I even meant to get to this crab? There we go. And all the all those creatures in front of it, it was really hard to get past. That's when you need to be able to throw some uh, javelins or something. Alright. One more level swamp. We'll see if I can learn to end high and I got teleported. <laughs> I grab a tambourine is fine against the lower dead named Hydra because they can pull it away from me for a little while. Um I don't know, it doesn't like uh insta kill it or something. It's not like what a mirror can do, but hey, it would keep me alive. Oh. Not Hydra's, but I think it was currently fine, especially with better armor. We do have a little named Hydra. But it's like a bony one. 27 headed Hydra skeleton? Sure. It's not just any old 27 headed Hydra though, specifically the Lernan one. Right? There are. Oh, it's true in here. I gotta teleport. Fine. Yeah, because everything was going to bite up when that druid died, which wouldn't have worked out very well at all. The skeletal Lord Nine Hydra, I don't think it's too bad, right? It's uh, a little bit, or not, it's a fairly small amount of damage on each attack. Uh, I don't see whose ghosts in there. Oh, there they are. And see, uh, Yosha's ghost, a Minotaur fighter of Okawaru, oh, 42 damage plus 20 something flame, but the fire one's not too bad. A bunch of simulacrums with them, I might be able to do them. I should actually bring the pull arms up to 24, shouldn't I? The time. Try this thing. 48 damage. Wait, why is this a point nine attack delay? What? That's the kid slow by being shield? What else is going on here? Let's actually try it on and see how this is, but I'm not sure this is worthwhile. Uh, oh. Yeah, that's fine. Where's my ancestor, though? I'm dead. Yeah, point eight, but I've got it on, although slightly less damage. So it was thing uh was including this slow down for the shield. Eight headed. I have a quick silver or something. Oh well. No, nah, it's not working. Uh I just have butterflies. If I were to do a butterfly, do they kill it? No, I'm not sure. That's probably not worthwhile. I'll do the butterflies, but I might actually just run. Once it starts to be mited, once I get my answers back, this won't be as much of a problem. Oh, this is freezing, dude. Honestly, I'm not sure this weapon's worthwhile. Uh, Go look for some branding, I guess.
Yeah, I I mean, Protect is alright, but I'm gonna try for something else. See what I can get. Heavy. Seventy seven oh, I don't know. Sure. Uh really. Um it's like the ideal, like, manifold assault weapon, but I, I'm not going to get that for ages. It's a real problem here. I don't even see my answers as health. They seem to be doing just fine. Maybe I was uh, more worried than I need to be. How does a zombie get mined up? Probably doesn't count as a beast or a zombie. Maybe it does. Maybe it still gets mined up. Uh, it honestly doesn't even feel like an improvement. Oh, that's disappointing. I might go back to my... Trident and shield and just Yeah, give up on that one. It doesn't seem very good. That's always been my problem too, added. Like unless you can get a manifold assault going, they just don't feel that good. Alright, got my rune. I think there's still like a little bit more to do in that place. Ah, right. I see. Let's get Oh, keep the evasion, I can lose poison resist. Uh, Alright, excellent. Uh, let's put the poison resist back on, although I'm not sure I'm going to need that on the vaults, which is probably where I've got to go next, right? Let's also check for resist electric. There's a potion of resistance. Is that it? Sure. Now, oh, well. Bolts it is, I guess. I mean, see, that'll like, yeah, with the holes, right? <laughs> Badish. Oh, Badish is. They find it going for opposite, but. <laughs> I don't know, I always feel like Demon Trides are just so much better, they require so much less skill. Actually, my willpower's down a little bit. Can I bring that up? I don't know. I would probably get might with my current willpower. Uh, but I've got to bring it up with like a ring of willpower if I lost my poison resist. Let's see. Let's give it a try. Because I can't carry that. What can I drop? Oh, I should go back to my rampage as well. Uh, because I don't need the flight as much anymore. From drop the one to flame. Right. I gotta get rid of these things quickly, so if I put a roots on these three... Not even a summon. Uh... Not looking like the best spot in the world. Uh... I think I teleport out. Especially with this dude that's gonna construct me. All right, that's better. <laughs> now I'm gonna spawn this actually a bit more sense. Well, I was trying to get to a doorway, but like I wasn't seeing it or thing, especially for that doorway I had getting constructed off. Yeah, like this is way better. I have fire resistance. 
Question is, how do I set this off? What's the best way of doing that? I set off this side. Kill the Thunderhold. Shame. Oh, this dude's gonna roll at me. Uh. See. Oh, it's gonna get up to me. Oh, it's over here. Get out of it. It's rolling, but apparently not. Um, I might put in a net. Oh, Missed with a net, of course. Ninety two percent chance of hitting as well, so at least it's theoretically a good chance of hitting. I can spy the fire. There we go. Oh, that was quite some ambush. I wasn't even my drill here, I don't think. I think these guys just decided to come along and find me. I still don't have any, like, quick throw or something, so I don't think I can stop those guys recalling if they wanted to. I just have to kill them quick enough so it doesn't lead to any problems. Alright, what have we got? Come on, be something good. We've got a manual of pole arms. I mean, if I do want to get it up to 24, I, I've got the manual for it, I guess. Um, yeah. Did this find an requirement? Why did that... What have I got on, uh... No, no, no. Why? What? Somehow I actually took my scrolls of requirement off. What did I pick up? <laughs> sure. I don't remember dropping one, but I guess I'm. Oh, I did, right? Uh, before I went into one of the temporary branches, I dropped one, and when I drop things, it takes more for all to pick up, which I, I should change that setting. I'm not sure I like it. Seems to be a bit of a nuisance sometimes. Uh... I don't know exactly where these guys are pushing me. Oh, but it's a problem. Need a curari. Uh, let's go see what it's offering. It's offering me a glaive, a ring of fire, just a manual, what, manual range for us again? This looks familiar. Haven't I had these choices before? No, I'm definitely, I mean, the manual range for us being every, every single manual, but that glaive of pain was, why is that the, I've had that before. I'm sure of it. It looks really every single option on there looks the same, which means, oh, oh, I still got an, um, have I left an acquirement on the ground? I have to. Okay. That makes sense. That would be why there's all the junk options again, so I can just get, I mean, the ring does something. Not really useful, though. Um... It's like the only thing on there that actually does something because they don't need the money. They got an ambulance or oh demon tron. There we go. I'll take that. Uh how does the damage compare on this demon trident? So 0.6 tag delay. Because it's definitely a med delay. <laughs> 32 damage. This one's oh, okay, this one's 29 damage. That's got a little plus strength on it. Draining's not my favorite brand ever. So let's go and see if I can. Rebrand it. 
Could make it worse. <laughs> Let's give it a try. Climbing's all right. Um, not like a huge upgrade, but I should uh, just enchant it up. I think the damage goes up quite a bit. 35 compared to my current one. This uh 29. Yeah, it's an extra 6 damage. Alright, let's give it a try. It's like extra yeah, 20% damage or something. Um, I'll no longer get the Vampiric Graining, which will be a little bit sad, but we'll see how it is without it. Oh, it's only 32 damage because of the lack of strength, I guess. That's actually not a huge upgrade. I don't know, it feels like a bit more damage. It is a bit more damage. Oh, Spectral Demon Trident. Oh, I didn't even chart this one. The Spectral one's kind of better. Um, I really like the Spectral brand. <laughs> Man, that was bad timing. <laughs> I think plus one. Is that worthwhile? I think like 28 damage. It's like quite a bit less. I gotta go with it anyway, just because I like the spectral brand. <laughs> really fun of pull arms too. Because then you can like it can appear behind you and spec things and stuff. So it kind of works in corridors on like a uh, normal spectral which struggles with that sort of thing. Oh, this is doing some damage to me. Also, Belayed Talisman, not really needed. What's the chance of getting marked? I must have some, yeah, 8% chance of getting marked. If I can get the thing enchanted, it'd be pretty good. I'm just uh, tempted to use the other one until I can get enchanted. Uh, no, I'll keep it using this. Well, it's more fun, definitely, with the, the whole spectral weapon coming out. I might back up a little. Some of these guys are pretty fast, but I think I can still back up. That's better. <laughs> get me actually into a proper choke point. <laughs> I'm out of minus eight corrosion. It'll be fine. I still got my answers out. What does the uh, little spectral weapon is affected by the corrosion as well? Because it's meant to be based on your damage, so it probably is. I don't know. Probably is. <laughs> They'll find their way to me. Yeah, they've got a oh they kill my ancestors so quick. I think I'm down to only one co resist right now, which is acceptable, but ugh, does definitely do some damage. All right, level two of the vaults. So let's go down again. So my armor gone up a little bit. Have I trained anything that would help with that? I'm not sure I can have. I might actually put on a bigger shield. Let's give it a try. So I got 15 shield. I got uh 21 shield. Hey, how does this compare? Ooh, evasion would increase by one. So that would be a 0 0.1 attack delay reduction. Yeah, I'm on 0.7 now. That's good enough. <laughs> Smart shield value. I'll grow into it eventually because I am training the shields. It's a really good shield. I should go enchant it, I think, actually, because I believe I got a bunch of enchant armor. You got seven of them. Might as well just like max it out or whatever. 
Uh, do I get gloves? Have I seen any better gloves? I don't think I have. Uh, I mean, I might as well. Yeah, because my armor's like plus 10. Uh, uh, plain armor. So I'm probably just going to use this till the end of the game. That's the idea anyway. I mean, if Bungie comes along, sure, I'll swap my armor or whatever, but... Get some strength. Uh, I'm in a fog zone, I guess Thunderhawked. I don't like how that guy's wide up. The is doing a really good job of defending me there. Hit the buffed, I think I need it. So many hard to do it again. Do I just how oh, did might just fog up again? Quickly take the escape match up. Get my health and go back down. Alright. The other we just gave a bite to each other, which I guess is fine. Uh Tune me for quite a bit, I might hit him with some roots. Oh I gotta teleport. I quite killed the guy for a recall, which is really annoying. Wait, this isn't the guy that got quick so was, Oh, this is, no, that would have would have done the trick if I had it, but I do not. Back up. Oh, I'm locked in here. Um, do I have a, do I have a polymorph? I do have a paralysis. Small chance of it working. Okay, third, thankfully. Probably just some. Oh, wait, my dude's already in here. Never mind. Uh, I wasn't going to care about this statue form. I've got really good armor, plus 10. Oh, whoops. What is this, dude? Are they a doable ghost? This Dexus ghost. They're a Formicid fighter. 250 health. 50 damage. They got like an extra, I don't know, 90 health over what I've got. Man, that's healthy. Did they leave themselves really late? I know they're a Formicid. And Formicids uh, can't teleport, so they get stuff to make up for it. But still, that's a lot of health. They, I haven't, like, uh, skimmed out of my fighting either. I got, like, 20. I mean, I guess that's not a huge amount at this point in the game. It was kind of average, I guess. Because I put so much into my pole arms, which I really didn't need to do. Uh, as it turned out. Right, so situations like this, I can't get my pole on, I mean, specifically because I got my ancestor there. I guess that's uh, slight down downside of spectrum. Oh, I will get rid of... I'll get rid of that. Oh, do I get rid of the plus five demon dragon? I mean, maybe I should. Oh, slaying. When did I get that? Kind of nice. Also, I might... Crazy charm weapon. I will do it on the stride on the spectrum one. Hey, manners to the holy Trishilla. Uh, means I can't buff my answer, so it's just sad. 
Hey, there we go. I can buff my ancestor again. And of course, he brings out the silence again. How many curing have I got left? Like five or something. It's a good thing I didn't get the spider's nest. Or I'll be out of those by now. Oh, my ancestor's confused. Ah. That's actually a problem. Uh... <sighs> They're doing so much of the damage. Um... Ah, it is romance, so I might have to teleport out. Yeah, I was doing pretty well, but then he mass confused. Um, I'm running low on these teleports. Whew. Uh, so go to lighting rod. Looks like you're gonna need a teleport. Thinking about the Everlight, but like, I'm not sure I can get it to work. Um, I'll give it a try. Crushed him in with the Grab Tambourine. About to blow up, okay. Still same Roker in here, which is kind of annoying. I don't think this works. I'm gonna teleport out. I'm running too low on these teleports, so. Oh, the Thunder. Ah, oh, it zapped me. That's what I was worried would happen. Now it can, like, take me out, can't it? Ah. Got a healing potion, but I'm not sure it does enough because this guy can smite as well. And St. Roking can smite. I don't think the fog's reliable enough. Especially with all those clouds there already. Try the healing potion, but I'm worried about this. Oh, thank goodness I'm teleported out. Now it's going to summon it. It's probably in a not bad spot for summoning things, so I guess that wasn't too bad. Might pull them away from that other big group of creatures and make that easier to deal with or something. That would be nice. Alright, Manus. I don't know if Charles are confusing my ancestors. They've got three willpowers. It can't be huge. And he can't do it while uh, everyone's silenced up, so. He can't just bad his heal. Ugh, I guess he can't do that well. Oh, wait, he might be able to do that while silenced. Huh? He lies, I must have missed. Pass. Uh, I lost his damage. I might have drink a healing potion. Oh, the, the, the holy damage isn't going to matter. 67 holy damage is crazy. Anyways, 45 damage. Oh, I think I just zap him. I got plenty of healing potions. Alright. I need more shields, actually. Do I want a Strachilla? I mean, if I'm fighting a demon or something... Plus three Trishilla right here. They're gonna merge. They're gonna merge again. Oh, they're, they're not getting out of sight, are they? Although, I'm not actually sure whether those... Whether the transplant walls, like, block sight in terms of those guys merging or not. Probably not. I think it has to be like actually unseen for them to unmerge themselves. That was way easier taking out Saint Roker in the corridor. I mean, it helps like all the the guys, right? But a little thunder hulk around. Ah, 
Ah, he almost killed the Thunderhawk. Not great. I drink a haste. Um, I think it's a huge electricity. There we go. Good. Oh, that's a little guy left. I don't think there's anything like uh, considerably large left or anything. I should just be able to heal up finally. More Thunderhogs? Okay. Uh... Oh, I was going to look at the rings because I'm wearing like a Willpower and Invasion. I want to try on the Slaying instead of... I guess it, uh, I guess the Evasion instead of that one because I do need the Willpower. Especially since the Snake's place to go is like the Elven Horse. But even here I need the Willpower. Oh, the Anti-Magic Buddy. Sure. It wasn't for the two added nature of their bodies, it might be good. Anyway, I think it's time to go to the elven halls, see what the elves are up to, see if I can fight my way through them. Now, that can resist electric, and he is not ideal, but it's usually okay. It's just these air mages could do some electricity and stuff. Also, I should do the Hall of Blades, because that uh, will give me two more enchant weapons, maybe slightly more, if we'll see. And I can bring this up to, bring this weapon up a little bit, but I don't think I'm going to max out this weapon. Kind of weird, it was like, oh, I guess it, it usually happens this way. You kind of just get to a certain point in the game, and suddenly all the demon trines, like, flood, and... Well, it's usually by, uh... Debs. No, because I kind of got three, like, all in a row. <laughs> Probably don't really care about these books, but I'll pick them up anyway. Uh... I also definitely don't care about the torment, right? I mean, sometimes you can, like, emulate to the torment, but it's always really hard to get going unless you're, like, uh, in death form. Right, Elven Hall's level one. No problems. That was usually no problem, so well, usually with how late I leave it anyway. Some people I know like to do the Elven Halls really early, and then, then the level 1 isn't necessarily so easy either. Hedgen's fine. Uh, I actually lost my Seamus Ball when uh, I swapped weapons, right? At least I know that there was Seamus Ball my weapon. I don't think I had the other source, so I certainly don't seem to have any right now. Can I even use this as a jar double? Let's go take a look. Oh, no. <laughs> Not till I... I don't know. <laughs> Find some other armor that's interesting. But what else would there be? I mean, actually, my helmet's more power. There's... Scarf resistance is pretty good. I don't know. Maybe if I have the gloves or strength or something. <laughs> There's not a lot more things that this character can want, though, in terms of armor. Chance of uh banishment zero percent. Well, that's really good. Is that high three willpower rather than low three willpower? This character must be at yeah, zero percent of banishment. But usually three percent is like one or two percent sort of thing left over. Right, let's pop this open. Uh, 
going to make me manually target this guy, which is kind of funny. Because technically, I don't know where it is. Yeah, quick blade. I haven't seen any distortion weapons in here, thankfully. Alright, what else do you got? I, there won't be any, like, pull ups in here that are worth using because, uh, you don't ever get demon weapons in here, I do believe. Ah, <laughs> good old executors, thanks. Those are really hard to use again because they're, like, two handed. <laughs> All right, what else have we got? Where's the where's my scrolls? I know they're in here somewhere. There they are. All right, bring us up to plus four. Wait, did I do the right thing with that one? Was there already plus two before? Huh. Yeah, I guess actually I don't know how that checks out. Anyway, let's uh, do this one so let's bring it up to plus 5. Charm level is quite important when you're attacking like 0 0.6 attack delay, although it must be rounded. Um, My shield will be slowing that down slightly. Alright, Hall of Blades done. Maybe they can take escape hatches on the level, uh, the third level here as well. If I find any. Oh, this looks like the top elves. Alright, let's go exclude this area up, then I'll go explore the rest of the level and come back for it. Uh, well, it's no point in really carrying that around. I mean, it does have resist electric on it, so if I was like a mage character, I'd probably take this as some sort of little backup thing for resist electric. Uh, buff my ancestor. Oh, I got stabbed with electricity again. I think I might just drink a healing potion. Um. How much does this actually do? Got rebounding chills, got rebounding blaze. That's probably fine. Wait, why did I take off my... Oh, I guess I did take off my poison resist, which is probably okay in here. Uh, it's not perfect in here. Yeah, the, the um, depths I'll take off the willpower, I guess. And I can put on the poison resist, resist negative, whatever it is in there. Oh, plate armor, there's crystal plate armor. I don't have enough of the jar armor, I'd have to find like a whole stash of that or something if I wanted to get some crystal plate armor going. That's currently not going to be worthwhile. Is this the same shop? Yeah, it is. But otherwise, I can totally go with crystal plate armor. Ooh, boots. Plus one boots of decks. Oh, I've still got the rampaging one. Now, my rampaging one's definitely better for this character. It's nice being able to rampage up to people because I never got into throwing, so closing distance fast is pretty, pretty important. Oh, more blinking. That's actually doing pretty well. Anyway, let's uh, let's go find some of these top elves. Can I still summon with the transparent walls of the way? Probably can't. I'm never entirely sure of those transparent walls, but uh, how is there actually one enemies could do around them? Oh, what was that? There was an item here. What are these? Oh, this guy. This got everything. Buckler of Reflection, 
Ring of Strength, and a Wand of Acid. Oh, plus 10 Trident, Heavy Trident. Interesting. Uh, Wonder Roots. All right, that was a bit more dangerous. It was Wonder Roots. Let's see what else we got here. Oh, Vampire's Tooth. What was that guy yeah, come along? Fancy stuff, which I don't need. The dudes to come back to life. I might buff my answers just in case. All right, uh, leveled up, which is great. I'm gonna run forwards here. I want to run back. Don't want to end up in like the middle of that room, surrounded by creatures or whatever. That's probably not the smartest plan in the world. I was trying to give me a ring of protection. Um, I feel like this leg is probably a better thing. Drop my old uh, that tried was good, but I'll drop it. Um, yeah, I doesn't quite keep up with the damage anymore, unfortunately. But apart from that, it was really good. Do I need a faith? I don't even know what title I'm going for this game. Oh yeah, I do. Hell no, I don't need a faith for that. In fact, uh, some say I don't need to get some more fighting, but the Hell Knight titles, um, in terms of skills, pretty easy to get. So many books. All oh, these books. I don't even need books. Oh, man. I've read that book. Book of the Sloth. Oh, that was a shame. I got the book ending. I mean, there were a few weapons around, but I don't think I needed those ones either. Uh, anything good here? No, not really. Oh, the old Drydens. Sure. All right, well, uh, hold on. I need to swap rings, put on the poison resist one instead of the willpower one, and then let's go to the depths. See how that is for this character. Got an acorn resist. I got a fire resist. Still no resist electric, but I think apart from that, I'm pretty good. Let's get it oh, north. My buff by ancestor doesn't get rid of confusion, does it? Uh, increase their strength, focusing on armor and the quality of their healing. Okay. He's gonna die, aren't they? Yes, that's fine. I don't want to buff them up and have them like uh, supercharged attacking me or something. That would not be great. Is that a doesn't do that thing? I'm pretty sure. Yep, there it goes, digging its way through the wall. That's a full on torment, huh? Ah. Uh... Right, well, they're gonna be digging their way through some of these walls, but apart from that, I think this is not too bad. That was only an army of demons, though. Uh, and just move back. This guy's attacks aren't gonna do too much, and so I've got resist negative. Yeah, and also those ones, uh, so we just, at this point in the game anyway, are never very tough. If you find them super early, I guess, they do something. Is that a fish tank kind of thing? With a dragon in it for some reason? I think it is. I don't think the enemies can get out of there. Oh, oh dropping a level. 
My read uh, Revelations. There we go. I don't know why that wasn't working the first time I tried reading it, so I need to go... It's actually a decent way to the staircase, isn't it? Uh, oh, six percent of paralysis. I, mean, I still think taking the willpowers off was the correct thing, but it's not... Not perfectly good on the willpower without it, unfortunately. Ah, uh, yeah, it takes up to the rest of the level. This is like the little demon room that had the quag's sake. Oh, the shadow? Ah, we should have another the quag's sake. Ah, I feel clumsy. Sure, I mean, that's not the worst one ever. Oh, wasting away. I think I can live with that one as well. We'll see. Uh, if I start building up the sad drain, then I might have to fix it up, but I don't think it's going to be a problem. Do I have a potion of willpower? Because that's twenty percent on paralysis. I uh, yeah, I do. I got three of them. I don't know what it is now because the dude just went invisible. But presumably, it's a lot better. It's probably more of these lunches too. This looks like it's a vault full of dudes that paralyze. Hey, and if one paralysis at the end, yeah, that checks out. For a vault, it's all about dudes that paralyze. Uh, shield's looking great. Let's get some more fighting. Um, I just take that all the way to 27 because the uh, skill uh, title that I'm after is a fighting one. It's a, it's a god one that's based on fighting, which is unusual, but that's what it is. I might have to double check that, but I'm pretty sure that's how it works. I buff the answers, but I could get smited. I don't know where the book ended up, but oh, that was a lot of fire damage for someone with three fires of there. Just Why is some sort of bolt is separated from the level? This looks like it should be. Yeah, it does. It uh, definitely doesn't look like a normal part of the level. That was for sure. <laughs> All right. Well, next staircase again. That effectively means I've only got two staircases. Not. Uh, is that a real one? No, it's a hell one. <laughs> My answer isn't doing it. Must have seen some other creature or something because they're just wandering off. Like, no, I guess I was trying to get behind it or something. I don't know. It didn't make a lot of sense. Whatever I was trying to do. Did I, did I ever find one to digging? I don't know if I did. Huh. Because I don't rely on enemies to do digging if I want. Um, do I want to rebrand the thing? I don't think so anymore. Like, earlier on, I could have wanted to try and rebrand something, but not anymore. Now I'm just perfectly happy to go on the spectral demon trying to chart that one up. Where's my... Do I want roots or grab tambourine? I might do some roots. Oh. I want to be confused. I'm going to cure that. I think this is fine, but I might grab a tambourine, these dudes. Uh... Yeah, 
answer, sir, it's God. That's part of a lot of fun. <clears throat> How do I set these off? Um, you grab temper in them again. I might. Alright, that's not too bad. Orange brain is a little bit of a worry though, so I might just... That's not this dude. I forgot to just tap attack this guy. I know where it is, but like, uh, it's invisible. A lot of dudes. They got a choke point, right? Yeah, this dude might wreck it. How oh, some of you dudes that might wreck it. I'll just go here, I guess. Ooh, hold up. How does that do so much damage? I know it's got a ball of cold, but ow. Um, I need to read a fear on these guys. I should actually get the invocations up a little bit because I just failed a um attempt to buff up my ancestor there. I get up to like fourteen at least. And also increase how much I heal them, which is probably fairly important as well. Like it hasn't been quite as important to get that one earlier because uh they've been surviving reasonably well, but it's pretty important to get it going now. All right. Hey, gold dragon. I don't need his armor, but it's always good to see a gold dragon. <laughs> It didn't even have any armor this time around, but hey, it's always it's always good to see those. I don't feel like they're too tough for the majority of characters either. Like some characters will struggle a little. That was well enchanted uh dragon armor, the electric one I'd take it as well. Alright, down level two. Almost. That's downstairs, alright. Is that to come at it from beneath? Oh, there's a bizarre. I've got I've got magic mapping. I might. It's still with magic mapping. It's not perfect to find it because there's all the other shops and portals and stuff. Something over there. Something over there. All right. Uh. I say this way. Maybe a little bit longer, but I think I'll be less monsters. Maybe. I'll simulate them up. My lack of walls are kind of a problem here. Um. I buff the answers of a uh I like how many of those dudes say well they could like hit me with the uh, exploding walls and stuff. Alright. Must be something I can drop. Did I still have that torment? Oh, I might have got rid of that by now. I could probably get rid of uh I've got evasion protection. I might get rid of the protection. What else have I got? I've got 
I got an enchant armor. I can lead that one around. I probably don't need the brilliance. That'll do. Let's go and see what we've got. Weapons. Ooh, potions. Um, I might be trying the curing as well, but definitely get the heal wound to get the might. Uh, probably the enlightenment. Uh, it's plate armor, there's gloves, and there's a helmet. So my helmet's willpower, right? Which is not too bad. Gloves, maybe? Fusion. Ooh. That's a magic points for my god abilities, but that totally could be worthwhile. I think the damage on the fast attacking weapon is actually pretty good. Alright, buy that shop out of stock. Um, could try that, but save is not very worthwhile, but give it a try. I don't know. Save is always sure. All right. I'll need a fusion. I'll charge as best I can, but I don't think I got a full set of enchanting. Oh, maybe I do. Some more here. All right. I might be done. Yeah, play dumb is not going to be better. Let's get out of here. Uh, in fact, I might go buy some of the stuff. Oh, where's the order explored trying to go? It's trying to go through the unexplored terrain. Maybe that's... I don't know. I, I, there's no real hurry to go buy this stuff. I guess it can if it wants to. Care for that leather armor. Alright, there we go. The staircase. So I'm trying to go to what was I trying to go to get? I was trying to go to get the uh, chant armor. That's the only thing I was wearing out of those. I might as well grab the... Oh, I should grab the teleport, actually. I'm kind of low on those, I think. At least I was for a while. I might have got more by now. Now, oh, eight. Eight's better than... Well, how it was for a little while. I don't know if I really need the manual problems, but sure. <laughs> Why not? It's a little late. All right. Uh, where was I? Depths 2 or something? I to give the answers a buff, but uh, it's a hard job sometimes. Piety's basically keeping up, but not not a hundred percent piety. I guess it's not a bad spot to be somewhere with a, where I've got piety, but even if it's not quite 100%. Uh, it's just more or less keeping up. I was a bit worried that I'd run like too far forward there. I was going to have to teleport out, but oh, seems fine. <laughs> that hit me. Uh, so that one unexplored staircase that I got to go to, and then I think there's one more level of the depths, and they're gonna have to think about another route after that. Where's my staircase? There it is.
And I'm done with that area. Yeah, there wasn't much to that. So it's uh, Dev's 4, I believe, to go. Oh, those ledges I could theoretically use my um, Holy Wrath. Sure, Shiller, if I wanted to. That... Not a terrible idea. I'm gonna stab this guy with some Holy Wrath. I hope it's worth the time digging the swamp. I mean, there's uh, quite a bit of bonus damage. Oh, well, this is quite a bit good for me. Boots? Oh, just two decks. Okay. Rig of five decks and a fire resist. I don't even need fire resist. No, the decks doesn't help that much. I think, uh... Body doesn't help. I'll just get 400 gold. This is a little silly, but... Now... This character's done really well the whole... Kawaii side of things. This happened. Mark. I haven't explored much to this level, which is... Not great. You know, these creatures fighting their way around. Alright, let's get out of here. Wait off the bike. Uh, this level doesn't need to be hugely populated, but it's Dev's 4, so it should be populated by all the Draconians and stuff. Maybe I just haven't seen them yet. But clearly they don't have an easy way to get to me. Oh, that's one of them. Otherwise they would all come running along. Ow, why is the cold damage doing so much to me? Why drink a resistance? Still fine with that health. Oh, not anymore. Now I need a healing potion. I've got plenty of those at least. Oh, that's a lot of dudes. Uh... What else is this? Huh? There should not be a gem here, right? I'm well, I've got the gem times on and it's not. Okay, I'm gonna teleport, but. You figure out what's going on with that gem later on. <laughs> I think that's one of the ones that should have broken, but hasn't. Those, uh, I know there was a bug that was doing that. It's probably still a thing. Let's go take a look. I think I might have just got a free gem, though. It's, I think it is broken. There's a possibly delicate weight in my hands. Yeah, it's shattered. It's, it is one of those ones that, uh, wait, the depths has a shattered? Oh, that's what I just picked up. No. What? But, hold up. This is showing me as having the dungeon one. How did I find the dungeon gem at the bottom of the depths? Huh? That's even weirder. Okay. <laughs> it's probably part of the same bug, but it's still super strange. I don't like being fragile right now. I might buff my ancestor. That doesn't help me though. Can't buff myself. That would be nice. Uh, my ancestor's kind of whittling this guy down. Oh, there's a crystal sphere one. I don't like a fragile at least, but I should keep on retreating back. Blackboard should be fine. Oh, apparently my ancestors died at some stage. I don't know how that happened. Sounds it up, but it's still got a couple of the crystal spheres out.
Yeah, so there's a lot of dudes coming along here, so something must have ambushed my ancestors on the way back there. Uh... All right, level 25. Oh, I'm fragile again. I like how it got a little, uh, little, little indicator on your sprite to show that you're fragile. It's a lot easier to notice because you're often looking around where your character is instead of looking at your like status bars over to the side and stuff. More teleports. What else have we got? Got the way down, got some hats. So I got a hat of fire resist rampage. That's actually not terrible. I got a willpower on my head right now. I've got the rampage on my boots. Um I'm fine with the fire resist. Let's take out this other hat. Cold resist intelligence. It's like quite protective. Oh, what's well, that little dude there? Uh gloves don't matter. Yeah, plus four. That would actually be more of a class to lose. I don't know if I should lose the willpower. What did it give cold resist? Uh, almost. I almost should like swap some stuff around. <laughs> and put that one on. Oh, I don't need a ring of wizardry index. That doesn't do much for me. All right, well, I'm done with the depths. I gotta go get. Uh, I gotta get get another uh, like rune or something. I could get the vaults five one. I think. That's a region on at least. I read the teleport and go down. Oh, that's a big glitch. <laughs> so much for that teleport. Let's uh let's read another one, but I gotta start an emulation. Come on. <sighs> Don't think so. I'm not liking the look of that. I might teleport again, but I'm worried about that Quicksilver Dragon. Because it's going to not really help the teleport. <laughs> okay, that's better. You kind of camp out of this corner for a while. Oh, that's a big lich. Um, let's get out the anti lich weapon here, the Trishella. I'll do my best at hiding in these corridors as well. Because <laughs> I got, uh, well, I guess I kind of fell everything out with me and, well, my spectral weapon and my guy kind of fill out quite a bit of space. Still need that resist electric, don't I? But it might not happen. We'll see what happens with rings, but it's definitely possible I never get or just have to rely on. I don't know, potions of resistance or whatever. Healing potions. <laughs> Oh, that's my mirror. What else have we got in here? Uh, more fighting. I'll just max out the fighting because that's uh actually I do want to double check that uh that's to give us the title. I know the title page was wrong for this one, which does not help. Uh, that's not how you spell DCSS. So I could actually have to check the code, but uh, I shouldn't have to do this. Why is this light mode, not dark mode? I don't know. Anyway, what was it? It was, uh... Skills, I think? Something like that. And I need to look for... Hell Knight. So, yeah, fighting. It is fighting. I gotta get it to the last level, which I think is ranked 5 is the last level. God, he gets mag level, which he can do. And I am a human, so, okay. That all checks out. Uh, 
Uh, gotta be very careful here. I'm not too wounded, but definitely things in here they can do a lot of damage. So, yep, let's go get the Phantom Earth. This guy doesn't stop me getting it. Dance event as well. Uh... Oh, these guys are gonna get like a second life. There we go, because they they were getting brought back to life. All right, what can I drop? Do I really need all my like throwing items? I've never really done any throwing. I don't know. Maybe uh, I might get into throwing, but I. I... I mean, after I've done the fighting, there's not going to be a lot more training to do. Why does cold do so much damage to me? I, don't, I guess I only got one cold resist. Maybe it's just those giants do more damage than I thought they did. <laughs> What's up with this guy? Oh. He's fine, it must have been. Did they have an edit use? I don't know what it had. I'm sure that was highlighting as having a dangerous item on it for a while, but then it stopped for some unknown reason. Uh, the hat could theoretically be more useful than my Calmet F. No, it probably wouldn't be. Just think if I found like a ton more enchant armors or something. Uh... I could get it highly, more highly enchanted because my helmet's just plus zero or something. Oh, digging. Only three charges, but hey, at least they do get digging this game. Uh, am I carrying around though? I'm actually carrying around a bunch of enchant armor. Let's go see if I can use that. No, I can't. I might drop the flying boots. I, they, they're okay as a swap because I don't think I've got anything else for flight, but oh well. Wait, is that solid? No, there's the way into the center. There's usually a way into the center, so I was really looking for it. Uh... This looks sketchy. I'm going to read a silence so this guy can't hit me with crystal spears anymore. <laughs> there we go. That made that so much less sketchy. <laughs> Wait. It is solid, right? There's no way in there. Strange. Usually those usually those areas have a way into the center and there's like a little bit of treasure or whatever, but not today. Do you want a dart of disposal? I'll do like a throw that myself. Probably not. That would be uh, probably the most useful thing to get out of it though would be throwing it at myself. Although, would I have to actually hit myself with that? I don't know. I don't have much advantage, I might be able to hit myself. I feel like most things just auto hit you if you target yourself, but a lot of things can't target yourself. Good, more teleport on those. I think I'm doing pretty good on those 13. Yeah, that should last me until the end of the game. Because Zod doesn't use a lot of teleports, thankfully. Oh, my Pidey's a bit down. Huh. Be doing too much buffing of my ancestor. That does tend to happen a bit later on. Hemp Lake one is excellent early on. Like, they, they super can't be alive early on. They drop off a little bit later on, but they're still okay. This can result in you going through more uh, piety than ideal later on. I know there's liches here. Come on, I'm trying to stab them. Uh, I'll buff my answers even if I'm running myself low on piety. Uh... Not mess me like you have any guys that are here. I could pull them in with like a grab tambourine to lay them for a little while.
I thought he was going for me. Uh, I guess that's fine. I wouldn't mind if a few of them went for my answers and split the load between us. Oh, more enchant weapon? Definitely. I think some of these other things are good, but I'll just read the enchant weapon on my weapon. Uh, what else is there? Yeah, there's... Oh, I guess the enchant arm is fine. Fog, poison, silence, till I forge draw. There's a lot of dudes here. I should bring them back around this corner. Sort of reduce how many they can get to me at once. Especially with them trickling around this corner. Because this character's damage is actually pretty good. It's mainly their defense, which is... Oh, the defense is okay. Yeah, I think it's mainly... Like, it's not super high defense. They're more, more on the attack side of things, I think. I do want a box piece. Uh, did I? I got a little bit of Eva Cage, so I didn't get much. Keep the javelins. Do I have boomerangs? I might drop the boomerangs. This is, I'm not going to use the boomerangs. Surely not. Alright, well, that's both sides. I should have three runes. I'm also wanting to check on that gem. Wait, why is it bolt saying it's shattered now? Oh, this is, that's just because I'm in it, but I just found the dungeon one in completely the wrong area for some reason. Right, I found that at the bottom of the depths. I don't know why it was at the bottom of the depths. But anyway, let's go to, uh, Resort? I guess? Uh, that's better. My answer, so I gotta need them with all the radiate going on. Uh, these are turning into snapping turtles. Those are fine, I guess. They can do a bit of damage, but at this point in the game, they're probably fine. Also, do I have an excess of magic mapping? Because I might be able to just use it. Let's see. I have a lot of digging. I do. Yeah, let's just use it. Uh. I want to explore this little corner first, so I've got somewhere safe to back up into. This is kind of a good corner, because mainly when they get into view, uh, I can already attack them. So that's a, that's a decent benefit of a pull up. But I feel like the main benefit is pull up for this character so I can use it with um Hepnik Wana without any problems. Hey, plus eight Demon Trident. Almost there. I'm super surprised my answer's not gone. Oh, there they go. Uh. That last was way longer than I was expecting, though. Like, they're almost dead for so many turns. How much health do they have? That's probably the problem. It's like, oh, 110. Yeah. I think, does it go up to 120 when they reach max level or something? I don't know, something like that. Also, it looks like you're gonna have um, no problems maxing out the fighting on this character. It's only got, what, 0.9 to go or something? And I've got four more levels of Zot to go. Is that a tentacle monstrosity? How much do I care? It still go up. Okay, it's not Berserk. Okay. That's fine. Uh, strike is fine. I'm, uh, good instead. Uh, 
I feel a lot of damnation. Ugh. I think I can go up. I'm not 100% sure, though, for those guys their damnation. Um, yeah, that was a nasty little spot. And, mm, I feel like there must be a way I could have done that better instead of just running in there. Does that fear work on an electric dragon? It does not. I'll drink a resistance. I think this is Quicksilver Dragon. Ugh. Bring that one upstairs, I guess. Right. Uh... I'll probably pull this guy back. Oh, well, let me. As this is doing just fine and fighting it anyway, I might not need to. All right, but once you get them next to you, to you they can't hit you with damnation. Still, the scarf resistance on, which is necessary because my only sort of cold resist. <laughs> it's character's resistance is a very lopsided one of everything. It's good though. Uh... Stortion, I see. I can pull up too. It's not ideal when it comes to the starch because it means it can smack me through my ancestor. Although to be fair, even if it's going for my ancestor, it might like uh blink my ancestor out of there and then go for me. So it's not too much difference if it's going for me directly. Oh, I buff my ancestor. Oh, hey, over fire. Um, ouch. I forget a haste potion, but oh. Hi, drink a healing potion. Doesn't heal a lot. Drink another one. There we go. Master fighting. The overfire is dead. What do I want to get? I can get shields. I can get pole arms. I can get invocations. I can get more armor. I bring the armor up to like 16. Shields up to like 25 or something. Uh... Okay. Although that wind. Oh, the wind drake won't do too much to me, I guess. It's summoned. There we go, summon is dead. Should stop that while doing its thing. How much damage is a bolt? Oh, bolt ready I'm resistant to it. It's a bolt of electricity I gotta look at. So that can do about 60 damage. I should make a healing potion. Huh. Uh, I think I can escape here. It's a long way to the decent staircase, though. I don't know. <laughs> Might just be able to hide around this corner and heal up a little bit. Maybe. Ooh, why did I... Oh! I got the Berserk mutation, don't I? Um, I don't know how many potions I got to, like, reset that. That's not great. Um... <laughs> Okay, let's uh let's go look into that now. So I've got uh all oh, seven mutation. I've got some. Let's try try it. What is deteriorating? Oh, minus scrolls. Let's try it again. Still minus scrolls, and I think my helmet popped off. Let's try this again. 
Uh, that looks fine. I pass the map and area around me. Do I still need that? I do kind of still need that willpower. <laughs> Otherwise, I've got a really nice hat there. <laughs> Off the answer, so uh, party's definitely not quite keeping up though. Uh, how much damage is the Quicksilver? It's 60 damage as well. Up to 60 damage. Arr. That's sketchy. I don't want to get the uh, one shot by that dude, so. I Definitely threw an A healing potion. Almost required another one though. I don't think running up to those guys is a good idea. I'll take some damnation, but I'll run away. <sighs> well, the shift had other ideas. I guess I won't run away then, but at least it's not put me in a terrible spot. Uh, off the answers because I'm not sure. Yeah, maybe there was an invisible guy there, but I was a bit worried that there might be. Oh, tentacle monster or these berserk. It's probably fine. It's actually almost dead. Poo. I'm so low on digging, but oh. not even working perfectly as a choke point either. Back up a little bit, although it's not quite working. Might be able to back up into this little room and pull the guys in close. Oh, so break the door? That was silly. Well, bad of it. Uh, it's not too bad, though. At least I got my answers back so I can finish them off. No problems. Excellent. That's second level Zod. I gotta be kind of careful going down these levels of Zod. Oh, what do you got here? Hat that don't know what it does, and Folo's Ghost, a genie hedge wizard. That can be kind of painful because they're starting magic dance and carry them very far. Got Monstrous Menagerie, which at this point in the game isn't that great. Yeah, this spell is, this is a terrible spell, essentially. <laughs> For someone that's got all the way to Zot. Wow. Sure. Um. Oh, wait, actually, I should go up. That's a bad error. Uh, and I should read the revelations. Figure out where all the edge of my map and stuff are. So I've got two more digging in case I need to dig into the edge of the map. I don't feel like you're the most used out of that one dig I did before, but oh well. <laughs> I guess we know why they're here then. Not outside victorious. Yeah, exactly. No, that was a that was a really tragic spell list on that character, for that ghost. Sometimes the ghosts miss out spells, but I don't think that was what was going on there. I think they just got a bad spell list. That looks good. Another, is that a second death talisman? I'll, I'll just check, but it looks like it might be. No? Well, a different character fell. Oh, no, wait, it says one duplicate. Yeah, that's the second one. Uh, none of these are bad while berserk. 
Like, it's not like super bad. They're just a little bit tougher. See some of them maybe weak because they're like mage ones. All oh, the blinking over there. Can I actually kill that ghost? I, I might have to look at them carefully. Oh, there's a. What do they actually use? I mean, they summon up monstrous menageries. They try and slow you. Got a little battle sphere, magic dodge, servitor. Huh. If it wasn't for that Hell Sentinel, I'd be going in there, but I'm not sure about the... I really don't like the look at that Hell Sentinel. Actually, speaking of those Ghost Bolts, I should have checked for some earlier ones. Um, actually. I'm transferring doors and stuff. Not Zot ones, so it's not going to be too tough. I have to see if there's any loot worth getting in these. Uh, I mean, spear's alright. What else is there here? Yeah. Spear, sure. Uh, right, those are really tough looking ghosts, but there's a potion of haste. I think this is worthwhile. Alright, there we go. Potion of haste. What other ones do we have? Uh. Why are so many books showing up all of a sudden? <laughs> Must like be like translocation or something. These look like weak creatures. Yeah, even the ghost is like two head or something. Alright, what's the next one? Oh, hold on, I gotta go to this transporter and I know how to get out of here and get to the next one. Um, okay, Dungeon Level 7, that's probably the one I'm looking at right now. There's a little scroll in there, I wonder what that one is. Should know what it is by now as well. Oh, teleport, okay. Uh, what else have we got? So there's, oh, of course, there's a door on the other side as well. Um... <laughs> I think the ghost in here was not too bad. Yeah. They do all oh, 40 damage? Ah, whatever. Hey, final level. Let's just get some more strength going there. See, my answer does get 120 health. Good, that's what I thought they would get based on previous Hairplay Aquanic characters I've played. Uh, what else have we got? There's one in Zot. That's not going to work. Alright, good. I think I can just go back to Zot. Yeah, I mean, that was blinking, but I'm actually pretty good on the blinking scrolls. I don't think it's worth trying to fight my way through that, because that looks tough. Oh, I should buff my ancestor. Uh, I might just make the other shields. Do I get some pole arms? I get the pole arms up a little bit. This guy's got a manual, but if that manual wears off, I should probably stop. Slide off the zone. I can almost use the zone to my advantage there. The guy was just like slightly too far away. <laughs> Right, let's uh try this one. Oh, quite close. Like, ah, let's try the one at the top again. That one's always clear. <laughs> oh, I got the trap. I might just hide in this little corridor though and see what comes along because this is not a bad spot to be. Uh. Oh, it didn't cancel my mic. Guess it didn't want to. Nope. Uh... 
my answer is kind of useless behind me. But if I put it in front, that might work a little bit better. There we go. Now I can actually do something. <laughs> Or however long it lasts. There's also a lot of fire crabs. Hey, Tiamat. He's got a good cloak, but I'm wearing the scarf resistance. So I don't think I can grab, get a cloak. I also can't buff my answers, which is a shame. I might be able to mirror up Tiamat, though. Uh -huh, if I get a space, I might actually not need to mirror up. Yeah, she's just got a, I guess, diag. Uh, I love the look of that cloak, but no, I can't. It would be, what, four or five more armor class? Uh, actually, make it work. Yeah, I mean, it's more armor class. It's probably worth it. Actually, it's quite a lot more armor class, isn't it? The hat also gave me... Like three more armor class. Uh... Is that a ghost moth? Gotta be right. Yeah, it was. It was draining my magic. It's like, oh, <laughs> must be a ghost moth. I wasn't going to go with the gold dragon armor. Actually, how many enchant armor do I have? It might almost be worthwhile. I got six. Uh, I mean... I gave me another cold resist, right? I gave me a poison resist so I could swap a ring or something. Either that or going with like crystal plate armor, but I think I might just go with us. Uh, da, da, da. What can I drop? Ashley, read this on this. Repeat that process. Yeah, I mean, it's uh, about the same sort of protectiveness, slightly more. But the advantages, I can swap. Oh, do I put a willpower ring in? That one? I mean, I lose it for this negative doing that. Just put on like another protection ring, actually. Do we have? We've got one of those, right? That's just everything. Ask, oh, where is it? Strength? Protection. Put on evasion. I'm sure I have got an evasion somewhere. Uh, I remember picking one up. Huh? Where is it? It's protection. Ah, there it is. Of course I can't carry it. Um, let's drop the old helmet, I think. It's probably fine. Grab the ring. Guess I'm gonna be fine without this willpower. I mean, it's down a little bit, but I think that's uh, better having a little bit more evasion. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Let's go to... What level Zolt? Is Zolt 3 still? It might have still been Zolt 3. Ah, yeah. Hey, there we go. My last enchant weapon. Right, this character's got a, like, a demon weapon, which is perfect for being a Hell Knight. What sort of armor do actual Hell Knights wear? I'm not sure. Because the eventual plan is to get the Hell Knight title. Um, just grab it on the old run. Uh, so, what, two more levels of Zot? One of them being the hardest level, of course. I've still got no resist electric, no resist corrosion. Um, but that's fine. At least I got a little bit more armor class now, which helps a bit. And the extra evasion also helps a bit as well. Hmm. 
Oh. Uh. Fine. How many of these could actually be a page with fear? Not that many, right? Go to butterflies if I need it. Yeah, so many powerful ones, and the powerful ones have got so much willpower, the fear just doesn't do a lot against them. Uh... Too much damnation. Because that's the problem with the, the polyps, is I don't stand next to the creatures, so I can actually be hit just fine by the damnation, which is not quite right. <laughs> These actual fire elementals, that means there might be some mobs of fire or something around. So those yeah, those are definitely real ones. They're not summoned or anything. I can't even... Oh, wait. I'm meant to be doing, uh... Revelations. Is that a fire revolt in the center? Who knows? I'll find out when I get to it. It could be one of the, like, slimy ones. It almost looks like one of the slimy ones, but maybe it's fire-themed instead. Do I not? Oh, I used my last digging. That's fine. Or is it? Is that guy hasted or not? Oh, it is hasted. Can't stop it being tasted, but I can get it with Gravitambourine. Uh Ooh. It's visible again. I think the safest thing to do is blink. I don't think healing potion quite does the trick. They've got enough blinks. So that's fine. I'll do a healing potion. Um I do have a fog. I think that gets me to the staircase. Yeah, that's uh, that's no resist electric for you, though, getting hit by bolts of electricity. Wow. Man, I'm getting really curious about that sound with how many fiery guys. It's probably just full of various kinds of fiery guys. That seems the most likely. Hey, more digging. Three more digging. It's trickle feeding me the digging. I've rolled that old plate armor. It's decent, but... I can actually swap my hat back, but I think I'll keep with the armor class one. Go with the physical defenses right now. No, oh, the plate was really good. It kept me alive for the whole mid-game, basically. Fine. Uh, there's, there's so many sad fills. This is like the fourth one or something this time around. Let's take a look. There's one, two. Wait, what? Oh, there it is. Three, four. It's got a duplicate there. I think I can just tree up. It's a bit far away, unfortunately. Pull it in a little bit. Oh, I've got a cancellation, right? Uh, I see. Buff my answer, sir. I drink potion resistance. <sighs> what do I got here? <laughs> I need this dude like one close, but it's not gonna move one close. I can transfer and so but I'm running out of piety. Um I could just hit it with some acid. <laughs> now like I probably should cancel up. Uh it gets rid of my potion resistance very well. Oh minus potions. Oh I'll teleport next monsters. Um 
It's obviously I don't need to reset these mutations. <laughs> A lot of wind drakes, I'm not comfortable with that. Uh yeah, it still works on these guys. I might use on some of them. You guys fighting it out, I'm not sure they quite are. Anyway, this should be fine now. I kind of spread the dude down a little bit. So I was going to reset my mutations because I have uh, random teleport, which is lethal. Oh, armor fits poorly. I lose a bit like six armor class. I might try and reset this, but I'm not sure. I'm running out of potions. Minus two dicks is fine. Oh, resist electric. Hey, those are, until I meet my next one with fire, those are excellent mutations. Which might not be too long. I'm hoping there's only one over fire in there. But... It was a it is a fire themed vault, you never know. There might be a second. Somebody uh Oh six haste, that's not too bad. Should I remember oh, I might I keep forgetting about that because it's actually decent with this weapon with a 0.6 attack delay. It's like an extra twenty percent damage or something, I think. Uh Let's run up to this dude. It's actually a shifter despite being red. Oh. Err, not all the fire. Oh, answers that didn't last. Hey, my mutations lasted at least. That's fine. I was hoping the answers can protect me from the mutations. Let it get some. To me, but they just didn't last quite long enough. Alright, let's go downstairs. Uh, I'm worried about how low my piety is, but everything else is going well for this character, so I should be on a magic map plus. Ah, one side has two Zot traps, so that one's basically off bounds. Check the other one. Ah, oh, the bot in chat trying to tell me views or something. Get out of here, bot. How did it underscore the. E and best. I don't know how it did that. <laughs> Bond knows how to do things that I don't know how to do. Uh, oh. Everyone's around me, but these are the ones I can do a bit of fear on, thankfully. Can I buff? I can, but barely. I do need a charm over now. That's for my gold dragon. I'll bring him up to 47 uh, AC. I don't need the scout for resistance. I got the dragon one, which is kind of nice. The TM out one. That's really helping my hammer class. It's great, and I think it leaves me with decent resist as well. And sometimes it gives you like half a resist or something. Oh, whoops. Ah. That was silly of me. I should have... I should have uh, not stepped back when I did. I could have had my uh, guy one further back if I just waited a turn and then stepped back or whatever, but oh well. It's an alarm trap, it's still got some cancellation. There's a lot of like Zot traps and stuff splattered about everywhere. How many haste do I have? Six haste. I got endless blinking, which is nice, so I can use those if I need to. Oh, good. Shields is where it needs to be. Armor can actually go up because I got a lot better armor now. Um, I have a conqueror, that's fine. I'm pretty sure my title will change when I change gods. <laughs> I'm not actually 100% sure, but I'm like 90% sure. Can I idealize? A 
That's another one. Uh, minor scrolls. Oh. Everyone's going berserk. Okay. Oh. Uh... Fine. Tell my ancestors to go fight this one. Doesn't help that much. Um. Oh, wait. Wait, no. Hold on. What I was trying to do, just get myself back a little bit. My last, uh, tr oh, no, nope, no, nope, I've run out. Okay, let's, uh, let's get these guys a grab a tambourine, pull them all in. I run out of answers buffs. I think I'm running out of magic points as well. But I'm also running out of enemies, so that's not too bad. Uh, I think there's a clown there somewhere, but let's just get back. Minus, oh, I lost my uh, electric resist. Minus scrolls is, like, not great. Um... Got two attempts, I'll give it a try. Oh, we got fire just two AC clarity of mind. I mean, that's way better than it was. I think I actually was missing the last fire just so it makes me out on that one. Like ground here, there's uh, a lot of faith. I shouldn't need that. My party doesn't matter. It's um, at least I don't think I re it requires a certain amount of party. I'm pretty sure it's just a certain amount of skill. A lot of the uh, special ones are. Hey, Sender One, how's it going? Are you ready for the upcoming tournament? To like what? Is it three days away already? Wow, that's getting close. I should think about uh. <laughs> Seeing who is actually in the team and it was the 30th, right? That's like really close. I don't, I don't think I can afford that. I don't even have any spells. Uh, is it that soon? I think so. I'm gonna have to check. I mean, the server hasn't mentioned it yet. I thought it was meant to be the 30th of this month, unless I got the wrong month, but I don't think so. Alright, let's get the let's get the orb and I need all the explorer to go in the right area there. Let's go to the dungeon. Uh, but I need to go grab Where is oh who is that Maglev? In the temple. Alright. I oh, started a game over the weekend, but didn't think you'll be able to play much of the tourney, so you're probably not going to play at all. Alright, fair enough. No, I mean, I'll see who, like, wants to join the team or something, see if there's a spot for you or not, but... Uh... What does this dude do? Spell and dead. Not as bad as the other dude. Uh... Actually, how fast is this guy? I have 20% speed. I think I hate stop. I can probably open doors. Oh, I can. Uh... All right. They get me down a bit with this torment, but I should just be able to head straight to the staircase now. Uh, do I want to? I've got a decent regen, but I might try and Ambrosia up a little bit on my way up here. And then oh, let's just go to the temple. That'll get me where I need to be. 
It was weird not having to hit the enter after saying go to temple, but I usually just hit it anyway, and then it stops my auto travel. I don't know, I don't, I'm sure I like the ability to not um, press enter sometimes. Oh, Petrify can. I got a cancellation, but Petrify's got a chance of affecting me. It also doesn't have a lot of health. It's also not fast, so if I just speed myself up. Ah, uh, sure. Take a bit of smite or fire or whatever here, but I should be able to get to the staircase. Still fast from the last uh, fight they go into. Uh, I can actually fight that guy. It's not even that tough. Also, where's my answers? It's probably got stuck on one of the earlier levels trying to fight some creatures or whatever. Uh... How many enlightenment? I've got seven. I might drink one because I'm a bit sure on willpower. Alright, Maglevs, of course, on the far end of the temple. Let's go grab them. What does uh, Hip Day Commander Party uh, ban uh, penance is not bad? You just don't gain XP. I have a fact to Hell Knight. Good, it did work. I love the Hell Knight title. It's um, Human of Maglev with Fighting at 27. So, not too bad to get, except I was absolutely struggling to get these Humans of Maglev going. <laughs> And eventually I just did Happily Aquana and that worked. Alright, well I'm at the exit, I might as well just leave. That was not a bad game. There are a few kind of close points there, but I got there in the end. Uh, that, no, that was like some, that was way too many tries. And then I got a bugged out gem. Apparently it was a dungeon gem, but I found it in the bottom of depth, so I don't understand that gem. It was one of those weird ones where you find them in, uh, broken as well. When you're out of time on a branch. But yeah, like, this took me way too many attempts. You can see, like, what is it? I think it was, like, eight guys or something. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven? And there was another one that died afterwards. I guess eight attempts because the successful one. Yeah. Yeah, it was the eighth attempt. Which is kind of bad, but hey, I got there at the end.